And we are live again. Hi, guys. It's WVOGS18. Sorry, guys. I restarted. I don't know why. I just did. Hope everyone had a good start to the week starting on Monday and had a good Easter. I know I did. I watched movies on Easter. Monday was good. And then Tuesday, I went to work and I got something in my eye. And it irritated my eye and I went to the urgent care and then they sent me to an eye doctor and they said, because I said I had blurriness and my eye was watery, they said, I have pink eyes. So I called out of work tonight. I was supposed to work from 5 p.m. Eastern to 10 p.m. Eastern, but I called out of work because I could be contagious. But all I'm going to do the next two days I'm off is just rest up, hang out, watch YouTube, appear on streams, the usual. Um, but I'm fine. I'm doing better than the other day. My eye was really bad the other day. But um, about other than my eye, I hope everyone's doing well. Um, yeah. So what's up, the Bud Files? What's up, Christina? What's up, James? What's up, Paul? Let me drop the link again. I know I restarted. Hopefully, I told Jay that he can join again on Discord. So, hopefully, he joins again. But that's for anybody who wants to join. Um, I was just on Paul in the 619 and his amazing friends live stream. He does it every Tuesday. I am there mainly, unless work interferes. Hey, what's up, cool gamer? Okay, so we got James, aka DJ Wise, AZ, and Pronto the Squirrel, aka Johnson. And we got Zach. Hey. Zach. Hey, how you doing? What's up? What's up? No, I, I was just in your last stream about to pop on. And then you and go, Paul. I, I'm, leaving. Right. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Like, hey, where'd you go? Could, could be right? your, dumb, your dumb ass could have said on your computer mouse and completely wiped everything out. That's <laughs> yeah. exactly, that, that's, I'm in the so, middle of talking. Next thing so I know, Zach, I got so Zach, I got a home I screen on my computer. The, Zach, I don't know if you heard the intro. Something flew into my eye in the garden center. Oh, no. Oh, that and was bad. R rated. R rated. Uh, <laughs> I, uh, I've been diagnosed with pink eyes, Zach. Oh no, that's all right. Well, Vogs, I saw you by yourself. I was like, oh no, Vogs is by himself. I think he needs some friends. Yeah, so it looks like the friends I came through. Yeah. Well, well, Zach, some, some of his friends aren't too charge. smart and did I'm stupid things and on. kicked themselves out. Getting, uh, that's whatever. Zach, I know you're <laughs> it's really normal. gonna be on yeah. now because of the farmers market stuff. Yeah. Well, I'm on spring break this week. <clears throat> yeah. So I just got the kids yeah. to bed. So yeah. I wanted to stop by. I'm not gonna be here long because um, right on, I gotta get more and do some more work at the farm, but um, I just want to stop by and say, "Hey, dude, man! I told you I was gonna stop by at some point when you went live this week." So yeah, yeah. Um, and, uh, I, I just got in a little while ago and getting the kids to bed, and um, good seeing you, Zach. Good to see y'all, and I, I just want to stop by and say, "Hey!" And uh, nice, yeah. I'm here to support you. I feel bad, Will. I was sitting there trying to jump in, and I was like, I was in the middle <laughs> of the stream yard, and then you died. He blocked. He blocked you. Where'd you go? Um, so. what's up, David? Um. Hey, what's I, going I on? Got, um, yeah, um, yeah. So I'm taking heavy duty drops for pink eye. Heavy duty drops. Okay. It sucks. Um, uh, but um, it wasn't it heavy duty drops that caused pink eye in the first place. <laughs> no, 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 no. I sent a picture to Paul's group chat where James is in. My eye, you could James could tell you, or in Paul. Literally was like, it was terrible. It looked ugly. Of I didn't course. think you were gonna talk about it, but you talked about care. it a lot. I don't care. Which is okay. You have nothing to be ashamed of. I don't care. Um, right now, yeah, Jay and I were talking baseball. Um, what's it called? Um, wow. So, uh, Freddie Freeman just drove in Mookie Betts. They're up yep. one nothing. Um. The Red Sox are up on the A's. The Astros are beating the, um, uh, what's it called? The Astros are beating the um, Blue Jays. I don't know what my Yankee score is yet, but hopefully it appears soon. 
Jay, is the Cubs game over? <coughs> what was the yes, end score? Twelve <laughs> two Cubbies. Okay, Jay. Zach, yeah, how's, yeah. Uh, how are the Braves playing to start the year? They just lost to the White Sox. Really? Uh, to the White Sox? Too. Yeah. Oh, well, it depends what the matchup is. You know what I mean? It's like the, you know, the, you the matchup the was against the White Sox. I know. <laughs> we beat them yesterday I mean, in a in a the, like a rain game, and then tonight we it was real cold. I guess we're not, just not used to playing in cold weather, so. Um, no. But hey, you know we'll beat them tomorrow. I'm well, it won't be it won't be cold for long. Yeah, we can, that's for Hell, we're, we're on a three game win streak. So we gave them a aren't one win because yeah. you know we felt sorry for them. So yeah, <laughs> aren't you aren't you going to ga- games in a few weeks, Zach? Yeah, I'm gonna try to when I'm on uh, summer break with the kids. <clears throat> I'm gonna take them to a uh, uh, it's gonna be Matt Olson bobblehead night, and then they're out on Tuesday night, and then they're gonna have Ron bobblehead night that same week. So I'm right. choosing between the two. I might go to so choose both. Yeah, I like to choose one. It's so expensive to go to a game. Like, well, well then, here here's how you solve that: leave the kids at home. They're obnoxious <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Zach can't do that. He loves his kids. Well, Jay, um, I'd love to do that for as I want to, but I'm a single dad. I don't have the option. To leave, them at home. <laughs> leave, leave them at the neighbor's house. Just pin a note to their chest. I'm lost. Dad will come back and get me later. Oh man, I, I was telling, uh, I was talking to Maiden on Monday night, Sunday night. My daughter went into Kroger on Saturday night, and she, um, she stole a um, one of those little things. You know. You, you like laser pointers yeah yeah and so on sunday morning instead of go to church we learned about thou shall not steal and we went back down to kroger and we turned that back in and we apologized to the kroger staff oh, <laughs> what did the wow. kroger staff say they were nice about it they, were they, appreciated, oh, probably. Yeah. they, yeah. they said that's fine they didn't worry about it i said well i hope she learned her lesson that she yeah, my mother and, did the same thing to me trust yeah. me yeah. it worked yeah yeah, yeah. Yep, my mama yep. told me no gum. Half hour later, she caught me chewing some, and I I was drugged to the freaking F and N grocery store. My mom said my son stole that. Call the police. Hand him a broom. He will work till they get here. I was yep. five. I was yeah. terrified. I was going <laughs> to jail for the rest of my life. I just knew it. <laughs> well, never, she, she, she learned her lesson. Then, uh, I took her down to again. um. I took her down. I made her turn it in herself. I made her walk in the store and um nice. and apologize. And she, you know, she's young. She's gonna make mistake. She learned. She'd never do that again. And yeah, uh, did she yeah. cry yeah. a lot? I'm guessing. That's good. You did good, Zach. Yeah, yeah. You gotta oh, do. I know. I did. I cried right the whole damn time. It, yeah. oh, it taught me. Yeah, she, she, uh, <clears throat> she learned that she's not supposed to be be doing that. And but that was Easter, you know. So it was kind of kind of crazy, but. This yeah. thing's learned, you know, we all make mistakes in life. Yeah, we all make mistakes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah we do. Um, as long as you learn from them. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. And then yeah, uh, the, I was telling Jay the Charlotte Knights open their season tonight at home, but of course I can't go. I'm probably going to go next week or the week after. My Iowa Cubs open today, and I'm sitting at home on my couch. <laughs> What's up? Go. What's up, Orlando? Yeah, the Marlins are a rebuilding team for sure. Hmm. The Marlins have been rebuilding every year, haven't they? Since 2003, basically, yeah. Well, they yeah, they're a small market. market. Hon- honestly, the only team that the, Mar- the Marlins can beat are my freaking Cubbies. <laughs> and, and it drives me absolutely batshit. Hey, David. <laughs> yeah. Who are the Jays playing on April 14th? That should be fun. And is it a promotional game? I hope it is. That'd be cool. Yeah, because when I went to my last professional game, I'll show. I went to Yankees. Uh, who was it? I can't remember who the Yankees were playing. Oh, it was the, the Tigers. It was... um. What's up, Barrett? Um, it was again. It was um, it was Miguel Cabrera's get last game in Yankee Stadium. And they were giving these out. It's a MLB Network hat with the Yankee logo on the side. That's cool. 
Nice. Yeah, and I love MLB Network. Either I wake up watching Pat McAfee, and then when he ends at 2 o'clock, I put on MLB Network and watch the highlights of MLB Central. And if there's a game on after that, I watch the game. I just watched my Cubby and whoever on them this year for that particular game. Hey, Barry, if you want, what's up, Rude? Long time no see. What up, man? Hey, if anybody what's up, Rude? Wants, if anybody wants the link, I will start the comment or I can drop it again. It's above. But, um, yeah, um, what uh what's new with everyone else? I know we were just on Paul's, yeah. which is always fun. Yeah, um, well oh go ahead. Well no, I just wanna say, you know, the thing is that my show wouldn't be the same without you, Vogs. And yeah. dude, so the thing is is that if you ever ever need me and I'm here. You know, you, you know what's so funny about that? I messaged Paul and he can attest to I'm like, hey Paul, let's talk. You always think something is wrong, but that's <laughs> yeah, no, because it's like out of the blue. That's what he I goes, thought. It goes, yeah, it goes. Yeah, Paul, well, every time, every talk? time my like, phone oh, rings, shit, what happened? I, every time my phone rings, no matter who it is, I want to answer with what's wrong or who died. <laughs> yeah. What's yeah. up, hey Paul? Paul, give a shout out to our friend right here. What's up, buddy? <laughs> what's going Welcome, on? man. Welcome the to the vlog up, show. Budget? Dude, look how cool this is. Collector's Dream had season tickets for rookie tickets. year Cabrera. Jeez. Dude, that's, right. that's awesome. I, I, had partial, I had partial season tickets for the Hornets for three years. But the reason I stopped was because they sw kept switching my ticket representative, and they never told me. So it frustrated yeah. me. Okay. Oh, I appreciate it. Hey, that is true. I I met Orlando at a card show like two years ago. Or no, I'm sorry. At a card store. We hung out for a bit. had lunch. It was like a 30, 30 minute to an hour hangout. And then when I was in Florida a few months ago, I was at a card show. I met up with him and Hitman23. I did a short on those. We, went, we walked around the card show and... Nice. We uh, had lunch, and that was uh, for yeah. like three hours. So yeah, I, uh, I, I know. I, I go to Florida. I'm gonna hang out with them. I, I got it. I got to do some sort of collab video with Doc one of these days too. With who? Doc T. Boggan. You do. Yeah, I, I need no, to. You should. I've I've been dealing with that guy for twenty years now. Yeah. So. I had yeah, no but, idea um, it was I had no idea it was him online as Dr. T Bog and Yeah, you complete, told me that. completely blew my mind. I'm talking to him, told him I was waiting for a buddy. I'm like he's like, Who is it? I'm like, uh, you might not know him. He's online. He's like, Oh, who is it? And I'm like, Dr. T Boggin. And he just gives me to look like you're an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> That's me. Yes, you did, Orlando. <laughs> yeah, yes, I had did, no sir. clue. You did get he goes it. live like at like one or two o'clock in the morning here. Uh, yeah, well, he, he watch works on the nice. replay in the Well, you know that's the thing about the comic, uh, the card bros. You know the thing is that they're <laughs> on at different times. Like Rex, Rex is on like randomly, like on like certain times at night. You know, I'll just go like go through uh, YouTube and he'll he'll be on like doing the live stream and just opening just all kinds of random packs. I mean, you know, it's whenever. Well, I've, I've been Dude, considering yeah. going live one of these mornings out there with my squirrel. Just, 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 mm -hmm. yeah, I feel like to show y'all what happens. Yeah, no, that's cool, man. Yeah, yeah, the thing I, is, but who the hell's going to be up at 7.30 with us old people that ain't well, already at work? <laughs> and, and you know what? I'm yeah. thinking about, and I've said this for months, I'm going to do a live Q&A where I only have one panelist. One time, and I'm just going to do a live Q&A, and I'm going to put a comment at that beginning. It's going to say, questions, and then I'm going to have people. So I'm going to do a live Q&A one day, no panel. What's up, Kevin? <laughs> let, let, me, let me know who it is. I'll research my questions well. 
<laughs> Zach, are you gonna meet up with them? Like, oh, Paul, Paul's on the street. Okay. Um, are you gonna meet you up know, with when, when they build the space time? shuttle? <laughs> I can't hear you. Sorry, what'd you say? Will? I said, Zach, are you gonna meet up with Kevin sometime? I need to. I need to. Yeah, Kevin's awesome, man. I need to meet up with him sometime. That'd be great. He lives in South Georgia. I live in North Georgia. So, yeah. do you have a guess? Do you, if you don't want to spoil it, you don't have to. Do you have a guest for Thursday already? I'll be honest with you. Um, <laughs> I'm not giving much thought to Thursday yet. <laughs> um, right, day by day. I, I need to talk about what I'm gonna do. I, I, I've been going vertical, and vertical has been getting me a lot of views. Um, we had I go people vertical always. I yeah, always go vertical, dude. I'm I had phone. 80 people in chat last week in vertical, and oh, I had wow. 1,300 <laughs> views in my live stream. It was the most viewed live stream I ever had in my life. One of my um, wow. One of my what the hell's videos. vertical? Are, are we talking a direction? Yeah. Yeah. So if you go in your phone, well, you can't see my phone because my Dale Murphy. But if you go on my phone, there's a thing where you just go live, and you can go. It's a vertical live stream. And um, if you do that, it links to the short stream, which, you know, shorts are always popping. You know, there's you get a lot of yeah. views on shorts. And it yeah, links yeah. I got one with 10,000 views on it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And and if you do the vertical live stream, you get a lot more viewers in the chat um, than you do. If you just go through StreamYard or, the, or um, I mean, we're on StreamYard right now, but I'm saying through the basic, basic view. So I've done it the last two weeks. The first week I did, I got 600 views. And then last week I got thirteen hundred views. Now Tim in Carnito Sports Car did it, and he had like two point one k or two point three k. Wow! There. And and for me being I'm monetized, so I mean it helps. Like it was a couple more dollars and monetization. Now look, am I making a yeah. lot? Look, and when I say a couple of dollars, I'm not meaning like I'm, I'm rich, y'all. Hey, look at me. I'm on YouTube. I'm talking about like two or three dollars. Okay, but what it's what something. what? What do I got to do to get monetized? I've got four of them with damn near ten thousand dollars. Oh, watch hours and a bunch of other stuff. Oh, you do? Yeah. Hey, you just yeah, gotta get yes, four. I do. Do you have four thousand view hours on those? Um, uh, let's see. You, yeah. <laughs> uh, you guys know how to look that up? Yes. Go to your okay. uh, go go on your laptop and look through analytics. Yeah, and it'll go to your. It there's a little thing in there. I have it says to, I'd earning. Have to, yeah, it says yeah. earning. Earnings. Um, yeah. So it's I don't know it. if you can see it here, but down okay, at the bottom my, of it, on my channel. That's an app. That's an app, isn't that the YouTube Studio app? Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm on my channel now. I do what? Okay. I can help with that too. Yeah, look, look, uh, yeah, right click your uh, click on the your profile and it should open up right below your view channel. It should say somewhere what YouTube Studio, right? Oh, Is you're on the for? phone. Okay. No, no, no. I'm, I'm on, on my... the computer. On the computer. Okay. Here, uh, I'm on here. my page right now. I can't see nothing y'all are doing. Hold on a second here. Let me see it. I pulled up on mine while, while we're talking. I haven't looked at it in over like two years because I've been monetized for two years. So I don't, I don't remember when I did it, but I had to do. All right, so Zach, Zach, have you ever gone to that um, Cards HQ? I think it's in Atlanta. Yeah, yeah, Jeff Wilson store. Yeah, I, Jeff I've Wilson been wanting store. to go to it. It's right near the Braves Stadium. So at some yeah. point soon, I'm going to. Well, in fact, when we go down to the Braves game, I'm going to try to go over there to it. Um, Not you know, true. Jeff Wilson is a very controversial issue in in the card hobby. He's kind of like jabs. Um, yeah. Jeff yeah, Wilson, uh, I, I hate it. There are a lot of good local card shops that are owned by good people in Atlanta that I go and support. Um, yeah. That's one of the reasons why I haven't gone to Jeff Wilson's store, but because um, he's kind of crushing out those smaller guys. But um, yeah, I would. I, I think I might go in there. I like it. I like to hear what the buzz is about. Um, it it's seems like, like a mega, mega sports. I mean, you look at it, it's just cases and cases of just product i'm like yeah. wow i used to live over there um when i first got out of college i, I lived over in stone mountain georgia which is on the other end of town but i just lived uh, like a mile or two from his store today i lived in a little studio apartment in that area in fact where the brave stadium is not far from where the brave stadium is today nice but um i used to live over there so i know exactly where his place is um you know, it'd be cool to go to. Um, what? I don't yeah, know if I want to yeah. buy anything there. I don't know if I, I'm Added looking for screen. deals. Well, it looks, what? I know, and that stuff looks like the full screen. retail. <laughs> yeah. But I, I look what? for deals, y'all. I'm not buying anything unless I'm getting a good deal. I'm a cheapskate, y'all. I want free or I want a good deal. 
<laughs> and I don't know if I'm getting anything free or good deal there. Now, I do hit yeah. my local car Probably shops up when I get uh, Chrome MVP buybacks or on National Baseball Card Day when they give free packs out. And I go and support them and I'll buy stuff from them. But um, I'm not going there unless I'm getting a, a deal because I'm a, I'm I live on a budget, man. I'm not I'm not going to be I'm not going out there and buying three hundred dollars of wax and in <laughs> myself yeah. broke like a lot of these guys do here on on the YouTube. Can, uh, can well, I I'm, James, how do I do that? <laughs> <laughs> uh, exactly. How I have my screen sharing on. He don't know how to add it to the stage. What? I have no idea. I'm on my phone. I don't know how to share the screen. Isn't there a way screen for him sharing. to like click click add to stage? Because my screen shows up here. He just needs to click add to stage. Oh, Vlogs needs to. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how to do that. Oh, okay, okay. I just found oh, my watch. Click it. It. I'm sorry. Yeah, you just I'm click sorry. it. Yeah, there you yeah. go. There there you okay, go. so I just found my watch time. Um, okay, so do you, do, you, do you see the screen, um, Jay? Um, let me flip over there. Yeah. Yeah, so if you click over here, It'll say down towards the middle, it'll say YouTube Studio, and you click on it, it'll bring up this dashboard here. And then, okay, yeah, and, and, he's, and he's talking about this earning button. Yes, this is it. Yeah, <clears throat> so, so there it is right there. Yeah, so you that's what you need that? to do in order to get eligible. Okay, cool. I'm gonna ex remove. Okay. That says go remember? back to that real quick. That says three thousand hours, but I thought it was four. Where does it say that? Well, I've, says... I've got nine hundred and two hours so far. Yeah, but I've got. God, hmm. where'd I where'd I put them at now? Damn it! Mm. Oh, I hate not knowing anything about this stuff. I know, right? As I'm um, still learning too. Okay, I'm gonna. Can I exit out of this and go back to the panel? Okay, yeah, cool. That was yeah, cool. Um, okay, I was just trying so, to help uh, you. My bad. Yeah. No, no, you're no, good. No, no. But um, what's it called? Uh, Zach, uh, Kevin said this. Oh yeah, down at the bottom. Yeah, definitely, definitely. We'll do he, it. he added another one too down yeah, at the bottom. So I've I've got four of them at over nine thousand yes. views. Yeah. What's Plus up? One at Trev. 7,500 and another at seven. Mm -hmm. What's up? God, that's Trev? like 15 of them at over a thousand. So I figure I'll just chip away at it then. Now, remember, there's some stuff that does not be credited for your hours. Shorts do not credit for your hours. Um, I've heard sometimes some live streams, I, I don't know, I, my live streams all counted for hours, but you got to be careful about what does and doesn't count for hours too, Jay. Say, like, nobody ever watches my other streams, and I've got 900 hours. My, yeah. my baseball card streams have like four views, average time six minutes. Yeah. Shit yeah. Like I mean, they, look, sports cards, I mean, it, it. I was lucky because when I started doing this, it was the peak of COVID. When views were unbelievable out the roof i mean i would go down yeah, to walmart too. and there'd be one pack of hockey pack and i get thousand views and i was like what i mean they were looking for anything views on youtube when i first started this so i was lucky i got a lot of hours back then but if you had came in if you come into this hobby now doing this youtube and sports cards and like in the last year or two years maybe even uh you, you're not gonna you it's real a lot harder to get it uh, there's then, a lot of a lot of guys then, doing it now. Yeah, <clears throat> but you know the thing is, Zach, dude, everyone knows you now, bro. So you're like one of the guys. So that's awesome. Yeah, I, 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 I once I it, it was a struggle. I mean, look, it took me a year, what a year and a couple of months to get monetized to get that four thousand hours. But I was lucky. I really, really was because um, to get to that monetization. You got to put a lot of work into it, y'all. I mean, it's not yeah. it's not easy. Now you got to get that one K first, and then you got to get those hours. Now I'm working on something else, y'all. I'm I've got this channel, my channel now. I'm at seven point two K, and that's a lot because of the shorts feed. But but I'm trying to work on. I have my gardening channel, and I'm trying to get that to one K right now. And then I'm gonna try to do build the watch hours on that. Now um, I'm working on that, so I'm trying to get to the. Uh, 
that's my next goal is I've been and funny thing is I started the gardening channel at the same time I started this channel and the gardening channel has 300 and something subscribers and the sports card channel has 7.2 thousand. So it's kind of weird how God, I'm going to steal this from. Yeah. Okay. No more viewership. Oh, <laughs> um, I'm going to steal no this from what? Paul's show. I'm going to steal this from Paul's show. Show and tell. Uh, I'm that. <laughs> that <laughs> what? That was like so <laughs> random. Hey, here you go. Here you go. Right here. Look, he disappeared. That's the show and tell. Look at, Look at this. You see this? Oh, where's that from? This is my trophy. Hold on. Let me show you something. You're going to see my nasty office. I'll show you one thing here. Okay. This is from my childhood. This is when I won the 1985 Mountain Park Basketball Association Championship trophy right here. Uh, but, but 1986. Look, it's still got the number 1986 on here. Uh, nice. This was the 9 and 10 year old tournament champions right here. So there you go. There's my show and tell right there. How about hey. it? And you can I see my it. nasty office. There you go. There's I my show it. and tell tonight. How about that? <laughs> that's so random i know right Bonds, you're such a bully on your own channel man yep. um, i wasn't right. expecting to do that tonight here will i just want to yeah, stop no. by for a few minutes and say hey yeah, um, <laughs> and now zach will never return yeah i'll be leaving here soon y'all i really do gotta go get a shower but hey cj stroud. stroud yeah i'm really high on cj stroud Oh yeah. Um, I know it's football. I know it's baseball, but it's what I have right now. No, uh, right here on the side because I wasn't expecting to show anything. Mm -hmm. Of course, this came Patrick Mahomes. The right now the current goat. Um, this kid right here made um made the opening day roster. Um, uh, Jackson Merrill. He just hit his uh, first home good. run yesterday in the no. big league. Yeah. And then I have are you multiple. Going to NBA, are you going to any uh, games soon? I don't have any tickets for any games, but um, yeah, uh, coming up. You know, the thing is, is that um, just got a lot of things going on, so um, I, I didn't have any plans to go to any games. Um, but yeah, you know, as why the season goes and see how the team um shapes up. Uh, my grandson's going tomorrow. He's going with his school. Um, Ooh. so I'm happy for him. Uh, we'll see if we could um, win some games. Right, right now, um, we, we're having um, bullpen issues. Well, you opened so. with the Dodgers, which wasn't easy. Well, we split. Um, oh. You know, you know the thing is that so far um, we're like uh, what uh, three and four, and every time we lost, uh, there were games that we could have won. But you know, if that's how we were last year. Um, and you know the the thing is is that they they didn't get hot until the end of the season, but by the by then they were like it was too late. I mean they were only three games away from uh, going into the playoffs, you yeah. know. Um, and, um, wow. and the team that ended up going was the Arizona Diamondbacks, and look what happened to them, man. They they almost won the whole thing. Yeah, yeah, you guys sound like the West Coast version of the Cubs. Almost went to the playoffs. Yeah. Start Start yeah. the season with with uh, a great Jake, team from last have year. <laughs> yeah, I got socks. <laughs> oh. Jake, Hopefully yeah. they're clean, clean socks. So I should have showed. I got a pair of socks yeah. too, Jay. Let me. Nice. I should have brought that. I got they're, some dirty socks. <laughs> He's got dirty socks. I got socks with holes in them. Jay. <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez, man. <laughs> So I didn't um, mean to bring out the big guns right away, but uh, <laughs> I, yeah. Yeah, I was under pressure. I panicked. I know, right? Vogs pressure. Uh, yeah, yeah. Anything else, Jay? I know you have cool stuff signed by Iowa Cubs players. Speaking of, opening I, I, I do, but they're all in those boxes right over there. PSA ten oh, socks. PSA ten so Oh no, them th them things have been in my feet and had miles on them. That's like is. PSA four. Yes. It's your turn, and then I'll show some stuff. Maybe. If you're gonna show your eye, put a warning. <laughs> I'm not. <coughs> there you go. Nice. Yeah, I love that. I love that. Oh yeah, Jay. 
Jay, where are you going to get a custom? I love that. Lady? Yep, one of the uh, ones I, that my wife made. I, for I, I, I was order. thinking about it, but right, right, right now she holds the top ten spots on the shit list. Oh, yep, yep. Okay, I'll go. Hey, t- damn man! <laughs> oh, 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 See if oh, I ever oh, come oh, back. Oh. <laughs> Jeez, you're right, Paul. He is a bully. <laughs> is it that the one you just gave away last night? No, this wasn't chosen. Which one did he? Choose? What, what, what's what's the rest of it say? Being a functional adult every day seems a bit excessive. <laughs> Not yeah, I I agree. I agree. Uh, the one that DK chose is the turtle. Oh wow, that's beautiful. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, dude, that's very Ace cool. Surfer. That reminds me so much of Ace Surfer. It, you know what? Yeah, it does. Yeah, that's why I brought it out. It reminded me of him too. That's very cool. That here, some of the ones I didn't do last night. Ah, shit. What's the hunting uh-huh. life? Hunting, uh, hunting life, life, man. Yeah, oh, that's so cool. One. There better not be any squirrels on there. No, not that I know of. My daughters love your squirrel videos, Jay, by the way. We were watching them the other day. Uh, what's her name? I'll give them a shout out. I'll uh, be like, hey, pr- Bunny Kins. Hamster, mm-hmm. They have code names on YouTube. Oh, oh that's hamster fine. Hamster and Bunny Kins. All right. All reminds you. And James, no, no, your wife no, made all no, of those, no, right? Yes, sir. Yeah, no, she is so talented. I'm a multitasker. I can listen and ignore, ignore and forget all the time. <laughs> yeah. That's a good one. I yeah. love it. Oh, man. All right. And then one that I just pulled earlier in Paul's stream. Ah. Oh, yeah. James. The Brown James. That's the Teal Explosion, isn't it? I think so. Oh. Yeah, I, I'm not good. a fan of that guy. I'm not either. But it's Some guys guy. aren't. Some uh, guys I aren't. Mean, First of all, it has what? a lot to do with so, the colors pur- James, purple and yellow. Think this is I, cool I cannot shit, be a fan of a team purple and yellow. I, I can't. It's unpossible. Uh, it's in one of those boxes. It, it's one of not the, um, doable. So, uh, I don't black care. Boxes James, Be- James, Bethany's going to think this is cool because she does custom stuff. So um, I was given this at Lowe's a few months ago. Nice. Lowe's appreciation 2023. Yeah, she'd do one ten times better than that. Oh, she yeah. would. And then yeah, you, you, should, best, you should make one. And then for my best friend's wedding, he gave this. I mean, obviously the it's a baseball friends. one, but it should be right in front. This is made of like a baseball bat. Yeah, love it. I only have oh, one baseball one right there, right? Wow. Now. That that's cool. That's cool. What is uh, that? I'm sorry. Um, you, oh, are you reading the chat, Boggs? Can you Papa. watch? Hey, what's up, Papa? Papa. What's up, Papa? Is this a Lowe's commercial? Yeah. <laughs> no, was this a Lowe's commercial? No. They showed off his Lowe's appreciation cup. Dude, they sell uh, supposedly the Lowe's football jerseys. They give the, the NFL players wear in the commercial. So I think I got to go to Lowe's tomorrow and get some pot and soul for the greenhouse. <laughs> Am I going to get another shout out to that? I will. I might. I might do one for you tomorrow. I'm done. I'm, so, I gotta, Zach, I gotta what, do you, what do you got in your greenhouse, Zach? Well, right now I got a packed greenhouse. I'm growing. I mean, I probably got ooh, twenty thousand plants in there right now. Oh, wow. I love veggies. herbs, uh, vegetables, and flowers, and um, I got some butterfly bushes and uh, a lot of plants in there. So I'm getting. I'm having. I've been out working the last couple of days, getting ready for my big plant sale. I got the community comes out to my uh, farm for three weeks. And she every Saturday show this they come out, and um, so I'm trying to get it all cleaned up, looking good. And yeah. are you my, going I, to film that? Oh, I do on my gardening channel. I, I do. I, a, I want the link to your gardening channel. Yeah, yeah that's what I'll my sister that. does for yeah. a living. Nice, that's the gardener and farmer, y'all. Uh, yeah. 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 Wife, you want me to show that off too? I my, that my, my, my my sister <laughs> does uh, the botanical gardens here downtown. She's one of she's one of the head dirt people. You know, go stick yeah. things in dirt and rearrange. I used to work at the line of botanical gardens. Um, tonight before I worked where I work at now, don't really that do yeah, that. You, you'd hit it off real good with my sister over the plants hey, can and I everything. Say something real quick to Bethany, Bethany, Bethany's in my head, she can't hear you. 
I was going to say, Bethany, throw something at James yet again. Bethany no, is not throwing something no, at James. No. Let's not. Let's not. No. Uh, yeah. <laughs> violence She's is not always fun. Violence. See, Boggs is violence, a bully. Yeah. Violence is always <laughs> fun. James. Yeah, Boggs on ratings. Hey, James. <laughs> Bethany yeah. said Boggs is allowed to be a bully because he has a he has one eye. <laughs> yes. oh. Oh. No, no, James said in the oh. chat earlier, it killed me. He's like, we'll call you one-eyed Willie. I'm like, one eye Willie. All right. Okay. Boggs, Boggs. Um, my my family calls. Um, I gotta take off. But man, it was so much fun to hang out with you guys. Uh Jay, Zach, James, Voggs. Hey, Voggs. I love you, man. Love all right. You. So, everyone. All right. Everyone have a good night. Night, Paul. Good night, Later, man. <clears throat> Thanks. Me Anybody I'm going to drop a link to that garden site, Jay. Hold on. Let me. Yeah. I'm yeah. I'm going to I'm gonna give that to my sister because she went to college and um, has done landscaping work until she got her dream job. She's pretty much one of the head gardeners or whatever they're called at the uh, mm -hmm. Botanical Center here in Des Moines, Iowa. You should actually check out their page. That, uh, you might actually see her on there. Check that out. Her, her name is Lob. Her last name is Pence. I don't know if I want to give the full name out on here. She might brain me for even saying that much. <laughs> <laughs> she won't know you're here, though. It's definitely. Yeah, I worked for I worked for three years at Ron. I got out of school at UGA. My first job was I worked three years at Atlanta Botanical Gardens in Midtown Atlanta, and it was really cool because like I got to see some famous athletes like Andre Risen and his uh, ex wife. Uh, what's his name? They called it House on Fire from uh, TLC. Uh, came that, yeah, down there. that that chick's who I named one of my squirrels after. So if yeah, you yeah. Lo, if you see a Lopez video, Lisa Left Eye, that, that, that was it. That, yeah, that's Lee. That squirrel is yeah. Lisa Lefty or Lopez because if yeah. you look at her ears, only one of them sticks up straight, the other one's down. Nice. <laughs> That's why her name's Lopez, just yeah. so you know. You gotta meet her. And then also Hank Aaron came, and that was the first time I ever got to meet Hank Aaron. He they oh, dedicated cool. a light to him, and uh, that was pretty cool. And Jimmy Carter came down there, so some famous people kind of when you know oh, it was oh, yeah. right in the heart of Atlanta. So um, oh, oh yeah, she that she was told really fun. Hell, she'll she'll just mention in casual conversation. Yeah, you know, so in six months ago, um, God, what the hell's oh, the name? Uh, Momo Momoa came through. Yeah. Oh, Stuff Jason like Momoa, that. Aquaman. Yeah, well, he, Aquaman. He's, yeah. Yeah, he's a local guy. Oh wow, I didn't know that. Yeah, he. Shit, both both him and that dude that played Superman are from the Des Moines. Henry area. Cavill. Um, Henry Cavill. No, no, the one that. It, Brandon Ralph, the one oh, that Brandon nobody Ralph. liked. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. They played for the same eh, soccer he team in here, his own here on one of the teams here. Oh, the freaking that's cool. soccer, a soccer team with Superman and Aquaman. Yeah, <laughs> that's cool. You got a DC comic lineup there, and yeah, yeah. So, I mean, <laughs> Momoa's in town. All hell, Momoa eats down the street all the time. Yeah. He was just in a. Was he the? No, that was Johnny Depp. He he was married to the the actress on that uh, the Aquaman right Johnny Depp was he got a divorce from who is oh, that yeah. one I forget her name yeah, it was uh, big that that crazy um, chick yeah crazy yeah. one yeah Amberly Heard I think is the name of something yeah, 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 yeah you, you know the best thing about that finally a man has beat a woman in an argument and it was a very public court case so the world knows it can be done. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, Texas hockey cards in the house. Shout out to Tex, man. How you doing, hey, Tex? Texas. Hope you're doing great. Yeah, Tex is awesome, man. Yeah, what's up, Tex? Nice. But yeah, so that was pretty cool. I, I saw no, but we were we were doing something the other day, and I, I, we love what you know. I do some shorts on my gardening channel on squirrels, and whenever I'm at work, I work at a college, and um, I, I we have a ton of trees. We we say at our college we have we have a four to one squirrel to student ratio because we have like 800 to thousand students and we have tons of squirrels you know oh my oh my uh, god but, get me get me a scholarship there i swear i swear to god yeah. you'll have eight hundred thousand fat squirrels yeah yeah <laughs> well these are fat squirrels they got some big we have some big oaks oh. they eat their acorns on and um 
I, I love to do shorts with them. Like during my day, I'll be working out, grab my phone, start doing shorts with, with squirrels. But we were watching, and they just loved your videos. And, and I was just amazed how close you could get up to those squirrels. And they just literally well, would just take the food right out of your hand. Yeah, I yeah, the, the big fat one. That's the pronto. That's the main What's bird. up, Texas? Sorry. Yeah. And shit, just today, I was looking out my window right here, and the mailman walked by, and freaking pronto was chasing him down, trying to get a handout from him. Yeah, so I had to step yeah. outside and rescue the mailman because he had no idea what to think. Yeah, if I'm like <laughs> a few feet from those squirrels. squirrels, I can't even get near them. Like they they run. So I was amazed how you do that. Jay. Well, that that's pretty... because all the people there, some people just chase them off. All it yeah, takes yeah. is one bad human, and they don't trust nobody. Uh -huh. Jay's the squirrel whisperer now. You know he can. I I, I try. <laughs> I try. <laughs> And, and it's funny. I, I was just telling people, hey, I hand feed the squirrels and, and they're, you know, ha, 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 picks or it don't happen. So I just happened to film one on a whim just yeah. for it. And from that point on, every day I get a phone call from my father. How's your squirrels? <laughs> you need you need anything for them? I, I had I had I had to lie to him and tell him no. I'm I'm actually out of squirrel food, but it snowed this morning, and my 80 year or my 75 year old dad who can't see does not need to be out on the streets when it's bright and sunshine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it amazing. Don't, it, 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 it don't it don't stop him, DJ. It hey, does Jay, not stop him. Oh share, my god. I <laughs> Jay, I know you don't share. Good night, Trev. I know you don't um, night, share Trev. your Pepsi. I kind of want to see what they would do if you poured a little Pepsi in the bowl. Um, rumor has it they'll drink it. Hmm. But right now, I, I can't do it right now, and I'm not going to do it tomorrow because right now I'm feeding them frosted flakes, and I really don't need a caffeinated sugar hop. So, you know, running around. <laughs> I saw this food hack on Instagram where a guy got um um Lucky Charms. He put the bowl in the microwave, no milk, and it made for the marshmallows from this big to that big. Probably. You know what's funny about that, Jay? Is I also don't need, uh, when my children, I don't like them eating Frosted Flakes and caffeinated as well, so it's about the same as that as a squirrel. What, what do they eat for breakfast? Uh, whatever I give them. No, Zach. What do you give your kids for breakfast? I used to eat little waffles. They're like yeah, that's what I give. I, I have these pancakes. I've been making them, and um, they also eat at the school too. So this week though, we've been eating pancakes, and we did taxes today. Today was tax day, so mm -hmm. we got up early, and went and did taxes, and then we, man, I was I've been scrapping today. You ever scrap before? Like those scrapping metal scrapping? So you know, I had a tornado hit my farm last summer. Um, Oh, wow. Watch my video on Zach the Garden and Farmer about the I whole was, story. I was Sorry, on the it. live, I think, the week after of the day. Was it that same? Yeah, me and you went live. Yeah, I was live down in, in a city south of me because I didn't have power. Me and Will were going live the day after that happened. Yeah, you and, were live from your truck. Yeah, that was wild. That was wild. I was in a Zach's park. parking lot with a camera light up to my phone, and we were going live. Uh I was in it like the only one in the parking lot, Zaxby's parking lot. It was like 10 o'clock at night, and me and he were going like that was a wild night. Wild night. I, 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 tell, I tell you what, next tornado to come through Iowa, I'll run outside, I'll run outside with my phone just so I can film everybody else out there filming it. Yeah, <laughs> so, you get a lot of views on that, Jay. You used to see the yeah, random you know, stuff. I mean, the, tor the tornado sirens go off, half of Iowa goes out the front door. Yeah, yeah, every, every time. Um, Zach, the, uh, do you see what Manta says? Uh, what's up, Doc? Uh, two pack that they have it after hanging around. <laughs> <laughs> no, but but Pronto did chase down one of your coworkers today, looking for a handout. So yeah, I, I had to step out my door and toss my last squirrel cookie to him. So are the kids asleep, Zach? I'm guessing because it's late. Yeah, one of them came in here a second ago. I had to tell, tell her to get to bed. We, uh, there, we got a storm. Here's the thing. It's been super hot down here in Georgia today. I don't know if it's been that way in Charlotte, but it's been super hot down it's here. Nice. And it's been nice. and up in Jay's house, it's snowing, right? There's a yeah. storm yeah, coming it's through snowed this morning. Yeah, I was watching Dirk Remington tonight. It's snowing in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. You know, 
it, but down here in the south, it's hot, and we got a big storm coming through the night, and they're all freaking out about it because they think the storm is going to hit us in the middle of the night, and they're having a hard time going to sleep tonight. But mm, it'll be yeah. fine. Is uh, but, uh, how is it supposed to go near the farm? Hopefully not. Lowe's, uh, it's in a city south of me. I've got to go get some gravel. I'm putting down a gravel floor so people can walk through the greenhouse. And so I'm going down there and I'm going a little sports card hunting tomorrow morning. So going on a little bit of a hunt. May it be a what, Hot Wheels what sports they, card hunt tomorrow. You and, said uh, the, kids, the kids are on spring break. What do they do when you're out and about then? Well, at the farm, I have like all kinds of stuff for them to play. Like they have balls and they bring toys out there to play with. And um, that, That's why man invented rope and closets. Yeah, and here's the thing. Yeah. The farm is a good thing for my kids because it gets them off the computer. Oh, That's the biggest challenge I, I face. When they're home, all they do is want to get on the internet and computers. And I'm trying to get them to enjoy life outside of computers. And so I, at the farm, there's no internet. So it gives them a break to be able to be kids and be normal and enjoy yeah. life and nature. You know, I have yeah, 10 I, acres a- there where I have a pond and we have geese out there. And, um, you know, it's 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 a place they can get to enjoy nature, not just be about being on the uh, YouTube. And look, I love YouTube. You're no, yeah. no, look, I love YouTube. I'm, I watch more YouTube than probably anyone in the world. But I'm just saying, you got to get a good break and you got to get away from this every now yeah. and then, or you're going to get burnout, or mm-hmm. you're going to, especially with the youth, man. I really worry about my kids. Um, yeah, I mean, my sister that. does the same thing with her kids. I mean, mm-hmm. her, her kids are what, 12 and nine? No, I got so many nieces and nephews. I ain't even sure which ones are hers. But <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no, it's true though. That they have their tablet yeah. or phone always with them. Yeah, exactly. oh, not, not these yeah. kids. You know, I mean, the yeah. boy always has a t- pocket full of dirt, and yeah. the girls off always doing something flowery and planty and mm-hmm. all that. Well, stuff. they get out and then they, you know, I have them doing all kinds of stuff at the farm. They're um, they're out there making. They were trying to kill fire ants the other day which i told them to be careful about that they were, oh, <laughs> they were all playing out they're having a good time though but they're can't, getting can't out there stop nature. A kid from being a kid yeah they enjoy what I, I used to do that as a kid man i mean you know we were oh, yeah. playing, building tree forts and playing out in the woods and oh, all God, kinds yeah. of fun stuff with kids and the kids did they need to do that man they need to get off them computers man i'm serious yeah. like and, and look How long i love you youtube spring break for the whole week the whole week yeah yeah, so I took off this week. Um, we are the, now they'll be off at the end of May for summer break, and that's when we're going to go to a Braves game. But um, yeah, so we ha- we're having a good time. We've been doing some things, going places. Um, we're going to go do a farmers market this week, and we're going to have some fun. You know? Oh, my my sister. Dr. Manna said, uh, uh, "Shout out to Collector Holic who stopped by. We didn't shout him out when he stopped by. I said, hey, shout yeah. out to Collector Holic." And Dr. Manistee uh, Bog. So yeah, Zach, the Cubs uh, won big today. Yep. For their third Zach, game in a row. Zach, Cubs are going to be good this year. Yeah, they, they are. Well Zach, <laughs> uh, Zach, I hope you could come to Charlotte sooner or later again. Yeah, I need to. I, um, you know, um, right now it's tough to get out. and Like I was saying, right now it's tough to get out and go places, but because um, I got so much going on, but uh, – you definitely. I need to get back up to Charlotte, man. I love going up to Charlotte. Anybody's welcome. Yeah, I think Paul's coming next year because he wants to go to Heroes Con with me. Now, I've heard about that Heroes Con. Where is that in Charlotte at? Where do they have that at? That, that Uptown Charlotte at a convention center. I'm not going to go mm-hmm. this year, but I told Fred and those guys. I've never been. I'm willing to meet them at like a bar afterwards or a place. Is that in the convention center right across the street from the Panther Stadium? Maybe, but I'm not sure. Yeah, I've been to a convention there uh, for Green Industry before. I stayed in a hotel there in Charlotte and went went in there. Yeah, I mean, yeah, we have uh, now. Now I'm on. I'm, now I'm wondering. I mean, my sister goes on those things for her plants for her job and stuff and she's been to various states because of it mm-hmm. I, I yeah I, I i it's a it's called it's a um <clears throat> it's like a nurseryman like a, it's a uh it's a, like a groundskeeping nursery. i used to be a certified grounds manager 
um, years ago. I used to, I, I've kind of over the years kind of had a diminished role because I farm. Like I do two jobs, y'all. Like I run a groundskeeper, I work as a groundskeeper in the day, and then at night I run a farm. So um, they're both, uh, they keep me on my toes. But um, with a with family, and I've had some things go on and stuff I don't do as much with the groundskeeper. Yeah, life, life happens. Yeah. Say, yeah, I, ten I acre farm, what... man. It'll 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 drain. Especially, yeah. I'm almost fifty, so it's starting to wear on me a little bit. It's... I I don't know what my we 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 just call it the dirty hippie. <laughs> <laughs> just just because I mean she loves it. She makes everything on her own. Blah blah blah. R rather self sufficient. I mean, she obviously bathes and being she's a good parent she's not doing all the other hippie crap yeah but we, we we just call her the dirty hippie because she's always in the dirt well you gotta love it that's the thing oh, it's like yeah oh will you love oh, i mean yeah will knows what it's like he works with landscapers at will uh, in the garden center a lot he knows what they're like you know yeah I'm inside oh, she outside. definitely loves it yeah yeah there ain't no doubt about it those, those mm. plants are sometimes her, her favorite pile yeah well, I, I went to school. I got my degree in horticulture at University of Georgia, and then I went on to botanical gardens. And I've probably been doing horticulture now for 30, 40 years, but um, I enjoy it. I love it, man. I mean, I started working at a nursery when I was in college, and um, I've, I've met this guy. I went to UGA, got his degree in horticulture, and I said, man, that's what I want to do. And um, I got to cool places. I got to live in Cleveland, Ohio for a summer. Um, and work in a greenhouse up there. I've got to work at botanical gardens, and uh, now I get to own my own farm and greenhouse, so it's real fun. I'm real blessed. So That's awesome. Honk when you drive by, Doc. <laughs> 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 oh, Dr. Amanis on a sports guard hunt. He's on, he's on the hunt, man. He, Dr. Amanis yeah. gets all the product, man. I watch his videos. He's getting yeah, good him stuff. and Chance, man. Yeah, oh, Chance is always on the hunt, man. He's got Chance, Chance man. He has the restocks, man. He he's getting all the good stuff sure well, i don't i wouldn't have the time well it's tough you know i go sports card hunting and you got to hit the restock at the right time right place and lately i've been kind of on a slump i haven't i should i should go out sport i'm going out sports card hunting tomorrow but like i did hit a restock last week at target but i just didn't see anything i wanted i they had upper deck golf which i don't i mean i like golf because the masters is in augusta down here but i'm not I'm not collecting golf cards. I'm not a golf card collector. Um, they didn't have, I was looking for that uh, hockey with Bedard in it and they didn't have that. Oh, yeah. um, they didn't really have much anything. I wanted they had some prism cello packs for football, but that's not much else. I was really James, into. what are you doing? Eating ice cream. What kind? You know, you interrupted him. <laughs> <laughs> it's well, show. Sure. I love it. I know. <laughs> Probably cheesecake. I told I, strawberry cheesecake. I told you an hour and a half of cleaning all that shit trash at work. I wanted something, and I want it now. You know what's really good? Is, I want um, ice cream. That's not fair. <laughs> Too bad, Jay. Uh, 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 vanilla, vanilla. You know what's? I really got some Briar's mint chocolate chip in the fridge. <laughs> vanilla. You know I need to go get tomorrow is uh, Ben and Jerry says a pint of um, red velvet. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, you amazing. know what ice cream I ate when I was in Charlotte one time? I went to one of those cookout places. You ever been there, Will? Cookout is so good. Yes. Yeah, and they have these incredible milkshakes there. Oh my they gosh, those were so good. They don't oh, have man. cookout in Georgia. So, so the they just got them. Is but the first time I ate one was in Charlotte, and I couldn't believe it. They were so good. Hey Zach, have you been to the original Chick Fil A from Georgia? I have, I have. Yes, oh, my grandparents. Wow. Is this my granny and pop is this down in Jonesboro, Georgia? They went to mm -hmm. church with Truett Kathy, who owns Chick Fil A and started Chick Fil A. And oh, wow. so I got to go down there to the original uh, Chick Fil A. It's a dwarf. They have, it's like a dwarf house. It's like a um. It's like a smaller is version. Of yeah. Huh? Is it still yeah. open? Uh, yeah, yeah. It's it's still down there. Um, it's down on the my my granny and pop knew him pretty well. Um, oh, they wow. would go to church with him. He was in Sunday school class with them, and they knew Truett Kathy pretty well. If you ever run into Truett Kathy when he was alive, anytime you saw him, like he came to the botanical gardens when I was working, 
he'll give you a chicken sandwich coupon for free anytime you see the man. So you want to run into True Kathy because if you do, he's going to hit you with a free Chick-fil-A uh, chicken sandwich coupon whenever you see him. Um, he's a great guy, a nice guy. I, uh, now his son's run Chick-fil-A. But I tell you this, man, if you want you want a good job in Atlanta, go work for Chick-fil-A because they'll treat you right, man. They take care of their is this, employees. Is that one still a functioning Chick-fil-A or no? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, And back when I was younger, Chick-fil-A was just in the malls. You know, they yeah. when Chick-fil-A first started, they were really just like they had that store, but they were more like out in the malls. <laughs> And now they've come more like out, you know, you see them all across the country now. But Do you think they have the best fries, in your opinion? Fries? I don't think their fries are that great. Their sandwiches I, are great. I, I don't, like I, I like, I'm a big McDonald's French fry guy. I don't, so I, I'm, I'm not a fry guy. Yeah. I mean, I'm they, not McDonald's guy, period. And unless it has their toy, that, that's, the only thing I get from McDonald's, yeah, me too. I get the Pokemon cards, you know. For the, <laughs> right. I buy it for the kids, you know, and then I get. I got the I got a toy box <laughs> full of unopened kids' meal toys from when yeah. I was like eighteen on. I mean, every oh, wow. fast food place I worked at, I was told, "No, you can't have a kids' meal toy." Okay, fine. You know, that to me, I hear one of each. Yeah, <laughs> you know. Yeah, I, I, I don't, you know, I don't, it's like the, they have these waffle fries, which they're not like regular fries. And I don't know, they're okay. I'll eat them, but I mean, they're not like, if I was going to give you my top rated fries, I would not probably put them in the top five. Like, Chick-fil-A, yeah, no. I would say maybe, I would even say Wendy's has better fries. Um, yeah, sometimes. McDonald's. Um, I'm thinking who has great fries that I've had. You know what's one of my favorite restaurants? The closest one is 20 minutes from me, and I'm just so lazy. I don't want to go. I wish it was closer. <laughs> I love Zaxby's. Oh, I do, too. The Zaxby's has Zach better fries sauce, than Chick-fil-A. Zach yeah, sauce never had them. Oh, Y'all have I, Zaxby's? I, oh, I, I don't know if we have. I, I'm not a guy who goes to McDonald's so or Burger cool King or Denny's is, or Red Lobster. I... I like eating at home for a you know hell of a lot cheaper. Zaxby's is they give you chicken and a piece of toast mm -hmm. and fries. And there's Zach sauce. And we used yep. to get it for school. So I used to get two Zach sauces. One for fries and the chicken and the other one I dipped the toast in. Mm -hmm. We go on Saturday nights. We have one here in our town. Every time I go by that Zaxby's, my daughters want to go get that hot sauce, you know, and the is uh, it good I hot sauce? Oh, my daughters love their hot sauce. Um, they like I'm, to get the, the wingless, the boneless, wingless, boneless wings they have and dip it I in there. The chicken strips. Yeah, that's what I get. I get the chicken, but it's gone up like it's nine dollars a meal now, man. Because oh, wow. they pay their they pay Dude. so good at that. Zaxby's there. Yeah, gone Zach, up. I went to the airport a few months ago and I got a large, I got a, a whopper. A double offer, a large try, and a large drink from Burger King, twenty one dollars. Yeah, Air yeah, airport. That's why. Yeah, yeah, airports cost more, and that's like stadium food. When you eat at the stadium, it's a fortune. Yep. Or a movie theater. You know what's yeah. really yeah. good is they have this thing in Germany because my brother lives there. It's called Nordsee. They have this really good fried shrimp, and um, they have this really good shrimp sauce. But one of my guilty pleasures I don't tell people I like as a dessert or whatever is I love Nutella, Nutella crepes are so good. Never never bothered to try Nutella. I've had Nutella. It's good. Yeah, I like Nutella. Yeah, yeah that's good. Long John Silver's I, is awesome. I've never been to Long John Silver's. Oh, my, in my town, we had a I'm Taco not, Bell, Long John Silver's combined. And oh, um, yeah. the Long John Silvers went out of business, and now it's just a Taco Bell. <laughs> wow! I can't. Really yeah, the, keep, I don't I mind Long John Silvers, Taco. but their fries are the absolute worst. Yeah, they are. They are. Worse. I used to yeah. eat uh, Taco Bell a little bit sporadically, but I love Taco Bell. That's yeah. that's one of my one. I love Taco Bell is cheap, and yeah. two, like I get. I I don't eat um. Well, uh, there's not a reason why, but I lost the taste of red meat when I was young, so I don't eat a lot of red meat. And 
So I eat a lot of beans and chicken and stuff. So they, I can get my, like I, I get their, uh, the chalupas and black mm -hmm. bean chalupas, which are absolutely awesome. Um, I always preferred the gordita over the chalupa. Yeah. Gordita. Yeah. They're, they're, they're yeah, so Mikey likes gorditas stuff. too. Yeah. And they've been having these $5 meals, right? You can yeah. get like a $5 combo meal there. And mm -hmm. I just love that. And then also I do it on the app and I get points. And then mm -hmm. if you get so many points, you get like a free item. So like I go in there a lot. So I end up getting a free item on the app. Um, that's how cheap y'all. I'm one of the cheapest people. On so YouTube. on my, <laughs> so you gotta my, use app and coupons. Coupons. So I, had a real, so I had a really good meal for dinner real quick. I'll flip my camera. Let's see, how do I do that? Or, no, Will, you're like glowing. Your eyes are glowing with a green light there. Hold on. He, he got bit by Spider-Man. You got yeah, lasers, so, man. You're like Superman. So my, Radioactive. So my, parents, so my parents are going to, out visiting my brother. And so I, they bought me this before they left. And I had this for dinner. And I put it in the Tupperware or uh, like a cooking thing. And I microwaved it for three minutes. And I just put on barbecue sauce. Look. Pulled pork. I, I, I have a very important question. One sec, Jay. One sec. Did One you sec. did you just say your parents weren't home? Yeah. So what? Where the hell is the party? You're doing it wrong. <laughs> I know. And then this is some good barbecue. Dude, and this is some good barbecue sauce. That's funny. Sweet baby Ray's. And I've been, Jay, I'm sorry your Pepsi's great, but I'll one up you. I tell you this, A and W you ain't no up in me ice cream. A and W yes, floats are the absolute best, man. You gotta have some vanilla yeah, ice cream. And then look what I have for tomorrow milk. for dinner. Mm. Yeah. Fried chicken. Can't chicken go wrong. Man. I, I got <laughs> fired from A and W. And then look. Oh, you did? Y'all yeah. have the A and W restaurants up there in Iowa? Yeah. Yeah. We used to have one at Lyra a long me. time ago. So, I mean they, they all make their they all make the root beer there on site. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. Right? And one day it was my job to make the root beer. And uh -huh. that also means you have to test it about every hour. And you always had to write a comment. I wrote needs ketchup and they fired me. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Wow. There was no, there was nothing wrong with it. So I'm just like needs ketchup. Yeah. You know, no no big deal. Oh no, they fired me for that. Wow. Why? Were you trying to be funny? Isn't that funny? Well, a, a little a little bit of a history with my father and uh the manager of the place. Um apparently my dad beat him up bad over a woman a long time ago. <laughs> oh, and dang. I got hired by the guy. He had no clue. And the first day it was an operation, they're like, hey, give your family's free meal. So my dad comes in as my boss is standing right behind me. And I tell you what, if if I could have died from the heat, I would have because I was burning from up front from my dad glaring at Joe and from the back from Joe glaring at dad. And I'm caught right in the middle. And then all of a sudden, I'm basically fired less than a week later. Yeah, he so was just looking. They, 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 Sorry, Jay. Oh, Jesus. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. I knew I was a man. And I'm like, you realize. That's crazy. crazy. It is. Four days later. Yeah. Do I have any animals on the farm? No, I do have. Look, I have three cats and one poodle. And that's all the animals I have. Now, my neighbors have horses and they have cows and all that. But um, no, I, I can't. I don't live at the farm. So okay. I have I live in a subdivision on mm -hmm. the other end of the county. So I have to go out there to the farm and um, I go back and forth. See, um, well, sure. I, li I live in like a suburban neighborhood, but I, I have my farm is out on another end of the county. So. Uh, okay. Yeah, I, have to, you know, I grew up in the suburbs, so I have to live in a home that's suburban because I grew up in suburban Atlanta, so I got to have that feel. But then I go out to the farm and I get that country feel. So yeah. I got a little bit of both. That's nice. <laughs> yeah. It's good though. Kind of like a small escape. 
Yeah, well, yeah. I, I would love the wide openness of somewhere to live, but I did oh, not miss geez. it. I could not freaking go. I am very upset about that. Does he go to the games? Uh, sure. No, I mean, does Mantis go to the games? I, I would assume so. Oh, I've seen him geez. there a long time ago. Jay, you, you need to come to Charlotte for a Charlotte night game and tell me to take the Greyhound. <laughs> mm. Well, I got to go to Wrigley before I go anywhere. I was going to say, oh, that. yeah, <laughs> you said you're meeting Papa Bear. Which the Papa be- Bear I, oh, my God. The second I can get to Wrigley, I will meet him. Yeah. 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 That's awesome. Yeah. That, that's the yeah. one good I, aspect. I mean, of the I, I, I straight told him the second we go into Wrigley, you, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna cry. You're gonna cry, yeah. I'm gonna cry for about a half hour, <laughs> and then probably, then probably wipe my eyes and then cry some more, and then get a Cubs jersey. <laughs> you you know, I, I will, I will wear one that I already have. You know. Isn't that cool? One good aspect of the internet, you know, bringing people together. Yeah. 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 That's what's cool, man. Is when you're talking to people, we go on with Aaron on sports cards on things on Friday night. You're talking to people to Hawaii, to um, Canada, to all over. It's so cool. It kind of brings us all together. Um, you know, I get, I get kind of secluded here in Georgia. Like I just live in my own little bubble and it's cool to meet people from all over the country. Like look at right now we're in Georgia, Iowa, Arizona, uh, mm-hmm. All over America, man. So yeah, and well, that's the same thing. Paul, Paul invited me to the show. I'm like, yeah, I've never thought about doing a YouTube thing because I'm not like a sociable person. But it's cool to meet all the different people. And by the way, yeah. nice meeting you for the first time. Yeah, definitely. I watched your, <laughs> I've been watching your streams, man. Keep it up. I saw your live last night, man. That was great. Oh, thank, you, watched, man. thank you. I watched thank you last you. night. Will was like on last night. Well, I saw, I saw yeah. you. Great. Couldn't have done it without him. I Couldn't watch a lot of YouTube, y'all. I watch a lot of yes. YouTube. But- Yes, I, I, like I, I, agree, I agree, Doc. I agree. I, I agree, but just, just like I told Papa Bear, the second we walk into Wrigley Field, I'm going to be a mess. There ain't going to be no stopping it. I'm not even going to care. But if you do I, that, I don't, care. Papa, I don't care. If you do that, Papa can film it for content. <laughs> I, I don't care. By God, I don't care. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm mad enough to admit I'd be a blubbering little mess. Nice. I really would. I I didn't cry when I went to the new Yankee Sam. I just I lost my breath for a minute. I was like, oh my god, I haven't been to a Yankee game in like 15 years. Oh, wow. And then no, you know what's funny is my dad, I'm debating the whole time when I was in New York. I'm gonna get a Jeter jersey. I'm gonna get a Judge jersey, whatever. And then I come back from the gift shop, my dad's like well, you didn't buy anything. I said, yeah, the jerseys were expensive, as usual. Unfortunately. That's not it's, where you want to bomb in New York. No. You don't want to bomb. Exactly. You know they're jacking up the prices there in New York, Will. Yeah, and, and if you're buying the something at the, st- at the stadium, don't buy something you could get at the mall across the street. But, yeah. No, you could buy I that cheaper in Charlotte, Will. Yeah, and I bought something from the Yankee. I bought a Yankee shirt that said Aaron Judge at a store for 30 bucks in downtown in the city so i'm um so it christmas time comes and i'm opening my presents we each go in order of youngest to oldest i'm the youngest i'm the baby and then it goes my sister her boyfriend my brother couldn't make it and then uh my mom my dad and then my mom and i'm opening gifts i got my yankees wallet from my uh, my parents or whoever. Um, and then my sister's boyfriend gets me a Brock Purdy jersey. And then I open a gift and I see white with pinstripes. I'm like, oh, this got to nice. be a Yankee shirt. I would have been hoping be for a Yankee. Cubs jersey. I almost, I, I thought I was going to cry. My parents gave me an Aaron Judge jersey with the Latin, with Judge on the back. But the thing is, most people should know that the real Yankee jerseys don't have the names on the back. 
So it wasn't the they authentic don't. one, but it was like close to it. And my, I'm like, why'd you get this for me? And my dad's like, because you were debating in New York to get one or not. And uh, you always wanted a new Yankee jersey. Because when I was little, when I went to the old Yankee stadium, I was an idiot. I bought a job at Chamberlain jersey. Now I have a judge. I eventually want to get a Jeter. But this is the judge jersey. Let me get it. You need a Billy Martin jersey. <laughs> that would be, that would be oh, I'm, I'm a huge Billy Martin fan. I oh, truly I believe he belongs in the Hall of Fame. Oh, yeah, he does. Billy Martin. Hell yeah. I love Billy Martin. Let me show you. Yeah, yeah. Let me uh, do it. How many yeah, times no. did he get hired and fired by the Yankees? Like uh, he had five. Like, Five times. I remember him oh, wow. getting fired like every week. He turned on the that's news. Not, that's not counting that they also traded him, too. Yeah. So because because of the, the Copa Cabana. So yeah. this is the jersey. Nice. That's cool. Nice. And you know what's crazy is my friend a few years ago was like, yeah, I went to this throwback store, and I got you something that looks like a Yankee jersey. And I said, okay, looks like a Yankee jersey. It is a Yankee jersey. It's two different things. It kind of looks like a Yankee jersey. It's not really. It's a baseball jersey. It says New York. It's not a Yankee jersey because the Yankees never wore blue with pinstripes. <laughs> is this. Oh, wow. Look at that. Kind yeah, of still nice, like though. It's still nice, though. I like the colors oh, on yeah. it. Oh, yeah. And it's cool. It has, like, the American flag. On it. Yeah, mm-hmm. dude, this is sick. So, yeah, um, it's not a Yankee jersey, but still really cool. Um, mm-hmm. I, own, I own three Yankee hats. Getting the Yankee jersey, dude, I, I thought I was going to cry. I really thought I was going to cry. I was like, are you kidding me? Like, okay. I, yeah, hope, no. to get a, I hope to get correct, a Jeter. Correct me if I'm Jeter. wrong. This this guy over here is gushing over how much he loves the Yankees, right? Uh, yeah. Duh, what, 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 what shirt are you wearing? I'm wearing Brooklyn Dodgers. <laughs> I I cannot wear another. You're, you're not going to catch me in a Padres jersey, even though I, I love Tony dude, Gwynn. <laughs> Yo, no up, Detroit dude? Tiger jersey. No, I know. It's just, I. this is a... This is such a cool throwback jersey. But I also have another throwback shirt that's uh, <laughs> Kansas City Monarchs. That's awesome. What, Jay? I think Jay went mute. What's that up, one? Joe? Can't hear you, Jay. Still? Yeah, there you are. Hey, are Zach, am I sure? Do you're my back. You're back. Good. Zach. Do okay. you have I just make sure y'all didn't go deaf. I, I was really scared <laughs> for you guys. Zach, I mean, all three of you going deaf at once, I, I wouldn't know what to do. Shout out Zach, to Joe Mansman in the chat. What, what up, Joe? What's Joe Mansman? Zach, Aren't do you, you have a Braves jersey? Oh, yeah. I have a Del Mer. I have a, it says Zach White, my name on the back of it, and it's three for Del. Yeah. What what yeah. am I, what are my buddies? Uh, his aunt David, uh, God, and it was a group benefit for a minute. Again, Bruce, Jay, no, you have to move the other way. The that dated way. Bruce Benedict. Bruce Berman. Benedict, yes. You know what? Bruce think- Benedict is now a referee up here he, in North Georgia, and he does college basketball games. And when he, you he go, was the catcher, right? Catcher, yeah. And we okay, used to yeah, when he one. come out, we go Bruce uh, when he came out. He wasn't that great player, but like he's a legend. Like, well, my college plays basketball games and he'll ref some of the games and you'll get to see him out there ref and I'm like, oh my God, that's Bruce Benedict. You know, Dude, <laughs> I bring a card well, to him and be like, can you sign this after the game? I know. Well he's a good TTMer. Like if you send him anything, he'll sign it to you for free. Oh so I'll you can tell Greg. Yeah. Well oh, I've gotten already gotten a couple of TTMs from him before. Uh, according according to Greg it didn't work out with his hands and Bruce. Because yeah, apparently, he, apparently she was the side chick to the side chick. Yeah. So. <laughs> well, he um he does some uh 
he he, he uh, you send him something and he'll he'll do it for, he'll sign you for free he lives down south of atlanta and uh, i think i used to have his address somewhere. i used to do a lot of ttms i gotta get back into ttm because that's fun man you get some free autographs like i got Shaq back i got robert parish um i've gotten oh, i like parish uh, yeah a hall of famer you know a richard petty and nascar um I've gotten a lot of cool TTM returns through, and there a lot of them are free. Um, that's what's so cool about it. Zach, I know uh, you already have Murphy autograph. Does he TTM? Who? Murphy. Who will? Who? Damn Murphy. Oh, yeah, he does, but he charges like 25, 30 bucks. He goes through a company. So you can't. I don't, I've got enough Dale Murphy autographs. I don't I really don't. I'm not go. I'm not bragging, but, and I don't have nothing like Adam's card closet, but I have like, 10 15 Del Murphy autographs. Uh, I, I, I wouldn't, I mean, how many do you does one actually need? right? Right? I mean, there's people uh, that I like to get uh, TTMs through that I've never gotten their autograph. Like, there are a lot of former Braves, there are people like, um, oh, like I like to get some people that like I was fans of as a kid, you know. And um, Turk, um, Turk Wendell, he was probably yeah. coming up when you was a kid, loved yeah. him, prolific yeah. signer. I would see if he does it. Mm-hmm. Um, just what's his name? Oh man, I got a good one the other day. Um, what was that guy's name? I got Shaq was my favorite one. I mean, Shaq was a real big surprise because I sent Shaq a '96 Olympic card from the Olympics in Atlanta, and he sent it back to me in like a big package. It was awesome. Um, Bill Elliott was one of my favorite ones, a NASCAR driver. Uh, that's Chase oh. Elliott's father. Uh, I'm, I'm well aware of Bill Elliott. I love yeah. the awesome Bill nine. from Dawsonville. Yeah, uh, Dawsonville yeah. is a city next door to me. Uh, Dawsonville is right next to me. They, they called him Awesomeville from Dawsonville. And in the town next to me, there's this big pool hall. Uh, they call it, they, and they sound an alarm every time Chase wins a race. or And they had a big – when Chase won the cup a few years ago, they had a big celebration. They have, like, a big thing for him over there. Well, but, yeah, he, he's the son of the prank Dawsonville. Mm-hmm. Uh, Awesome Bill from Dawsonville is what they called him. I, I was a Bill Elliott fan. Yeah. I, I watched this one. Career. My grandpa was a redneck. Mm -hmm. My my first favorite racer I remember watching live was Kale Yarborough. Oh, yeah. He from was there, great. I went to Bill Elliott, who mm -hmm. then told me to become a um, Casey Kane fan. Mm -hmm. yep. So then I was a Casey Kane fan until... <laughs> Chase. Yeah. His son Chase is awesome, man. He's doing really good. I always pull for Chase. Chase is my favorite NASCAR driver right now. Is, I thought is, I thought is Chase from North Carolina or no? No, he's from Georgia. That's what I'm saying. They had a bit when he won the championship, they had a big celebration. Now he grew up in suburban Atlanta in Alpharetta, but they call they say his home. They because his dad's from Dawsonville. So they, they kind of throw his face from yeah, that's yeah. He grew up in suburban land. You know, Give Will, you live in the heart of you live in the heart of NASCAR country, man. The NASCAR Hall of Fame is right here. Dude, and I've never been. Oh wow. Yeah. Okay. Now I've been to the Charlotte Motor Speedway, and that's one of my favorite racetracks in all of NASCAR. I've been I've, I spent the weekend in Charlotte several times at I'm Charlotte a, Motor Speedway. I'm, 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 I'm a big F1 guy though. Yeah, never, never been to the race. Race at a higher level than Jay, what? I've never been to a race at a higher level than ARCA. Oh, really? Yeah, ARCA's cool. I've been to ARCA race. There's nothing like a NASCAR race. Like, my first race was in Charlotte, North Carolina in, in 1997. And we had, like, second row seats. And I watched Wally Dallenbach take out Dale Earnhardt right in front of me. And Dale Earnhardt got out of the car and started yelling at Wally Dallenbach. Right? It was the greatest thing I ever saw. I mean, rest in peace, Dale Earnhardt. NASCAR guy, like, his, like, side of his car got damaged this weekend. He, like, threw it at another car. Yeah. I mean, they yeah. fight. Like, Dale Earnhardt got, like, on the racetrack, Dale Earnhardt got out of the car and started yelling at Wally Dallenbach because he took him out. And I mean, I just love. I was like, I was hooked. And in the race, like everybody hates Jeff Gordon. Okay, like <laughs> yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. He he's like the pretty boy from California, and everybody hated him. And so they, the people in Charlotte, and Will, you know this. There's a lot of redneck community that just love their Earnhardt. They, Annapolis, North Carolina, the home of Dale Earnhardt. 
we love Dale, man. And they stole the radio out of Jeff Gordon's car so he couldn't talk to Ray Everham during the race. So half the race, Jeff Gordon couldn't even talk to Ray Everham because the Rednecks had stole his radio to the in the race. Oh, that's genius. Yeah. <laughs> it was wild. So fun Oh, I love that. Story. Oh, yeah. When I worked for, uh, when I went to a Charlotte Checkers game, I met Martin Truex Jr. because his, uh, it was over in Stanford night. And then last year, the last year I worked Charlotte Knights concessions, I worked at a single popcorn stand. And I'm like, next customer, please. And he said, yeah, I'll have a Coca Cola and, uh, uh, a bucket of popcorn. I said, yes, sir. My head was down. I said, oh, my God, you're uh, you're uh, Jimmy Johnson. He said, yes, sir, I am. And I got a picture with Jimmy. There you go. You better be in front of a Lowe's car, huh? <clears throat> because you know no, you the it Lowe's was at the, no, it was at a Charlotte. <laughs> yeah, I was working the Charlotte Knights game, and he came to my stand. Yeah. I mean, and, and Lowe's is headquartered out of there out of Charlotte, isn't it? Yeah, our headquarters. Yeah, yeah. yeah hey, shout out the Rushman. You know Rushmore what's funny show? is my. What's is up, Rushmore? Chat, you know what's funny is my, about the Rushmore uh, show. Yeah. My store used to be the flagship store, and now that our uh, our the main guy is moving to another part of Charlotte, we're not the flagship store anymore. I saw the Rushmore shore, shore Kurt uh, on Burt's stream tonight, and Kurt is from Atlanta, and which is so cool. And he had a great show, man. He does some awesome, awesome stuff. Y'all got to go check his channel out. He's he's gonna be Ooh, last Rushmore. Friday with Burt, huh? Burt the Rushmore Rush. Shore, yeah, it's Kurt, yeah. and uh, they're they're awesome, man. They uh, they've got a great great channel, man. I watch them. They, sometimes they go live before my stream on Thursday, but they go Fridays as well. Um, Man, he's got a great channel, man. I, I was he, they were killing. I was watching that on my ride home tonight from the farm. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna go three hours tonight. I'm just in the mood. There you go. There you go. Yeah, it's a wild night, man. Spring break for me, man. I get to sleep in no matter. And we got a storm coming in, so I can't go to bed. Mm. So I can make it for a little bit. I gotta hit the shower Zach, though. I'm pretty dirty. Go to bed? Why? I got dirt on me from the farm well, today. You're up because of the storm. Go outside with a bar of soap. Zach, why <laughs> yeah, I might as well. <laughs> Zach, that radar. It's coming in. Go, Zach, why can't you go to bed? Because there's a big storm coming in right now, and it, it'll wake my kids up once it comes. So I might as well just stay up until it hits because they'll come in my room and go, Dang, Zach, there's a storm. Oh. They've been freaking so, out about wait, it. They've been watching be the weather. tomorrow, aren't you? I gotta sleep in tomorrow. Uh, I'm gonna sleep in before I go out on my hunt tomorrow and go take, go sleep, take it with somebody with load. experience as a parent. You're always exhausted. Yeah. Be honest with you, always. I'm pretty rested this week. Oh yeah, here it comes, man. It's wow. South in Atlanta right now, it's really storming bad. I wonder if it's supposed to hit Charlotte because I know we're supposed to get rain. It's a, yeah, it's coming to Charlotte. It's on its way. Shit, we I'm looking at Charlotte right now, and it's it's um it's coming. It's it's clear What's right now in Charlotte. But it's coming. <laughs> <laughs> you ever been to Rock Hill, South Carolina, Will? Yeah, just south of Charlotte. That's where a lot of my family lives. Um, yeah, I've been, I've been here. It's been family. forever since I've been out to Carolina. So, what are they I saying? Really wind to. and rain, or? Yeah, uh, look right now. I'm looking at radar in Alabama. It's there's some red coming in. South of Roll Atlanta, tide. Right Roll now. Tide, half of Alabama is always crimson. Always. Roll they always tide. get the bad stuff before we get it. Gross. Yeah. Jay, get off my stream. I can't expect it. Roll like Tide. Well, it just hit Tuscaloosa. So it's Tuscaloosa's clear. So you talk about Roll Tide. There's That's where Alabama is. Right? Okay. So, Zach, what were you saying? Um, it, what is it in Atlanta? Is it red? Yeah, uh, like right now where I live <clears throat> in North Georgia, it's it's green. There's a little bit of rain, but south of Atlanta, that area is pretty dark. But over in Alabama, there's some other stuff, and it's moving kind of toward us. And then there's a line. Oh, my gosh, there's a line in Knoxville, and that looks like it's heading toward Charlotte. Um, oh, I love big storms. I'll be honest with you. It looks like it may not hit Charlotte till 
either tomorrow or so because it's a good bill. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Wait a minute. I'm looking at radar. <laughs> and right now it's it's gonna come in overnight in Charlotte. You got some stuff coming probably at about four or five o'clock in the morning. <clears throat> Great. So, stay tuned, Will. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're not gonna get much sleep tonight. <laughs> Sorry. No, it's fine. I got all day to rest. I am not I'm not either, so <laughs> But see, what that is, is a cold front coming through. It's been warm down here today. Like, I was out mowing grass today. Is it only um, what, supposed to last for one day, or do we not know? Oh, yeah, it'll be out of here by tomorrow. Hmm. So, uh, But it's been warm down here. That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm, y'all are talking about snow. Like, it was so warm down here. I was like, man. Dude, yeah, uh, I, Rushmore shows they live in Decula. Yeah, we used to call that Dracula when I was a kid. The, the Decula well, Falcons. Uh, they used to, we used to call it, I know where the tequila is. I grew up in Lilburn, Georgia, uh, Rushmore show Stone Mountain, Lilburn area. So I know, I know tequila very well. Um, so yeah, Rushmore shore is going to stay up. They are probably getting more of the storms right now than I am. Cause they're down there South of me. So I live up in the Hills y'all. I live it. I live in the first Appalachian city. So it's the start of the Appalachian mountains really yep. is where I live. So you just find the Appalachian mountains and where it starts. And that's where I live. Mm-hmm. Not to give everybody here on YouTube, but hey, this is where Zach lives. Dang, That's the area. Dang, where I, I, this is where the Zach lives. Yeah. yeah. Dang, Come on over. I live network. in the hills. Sci-fi <laughs> network is doing. I, I've seen I've network. seen spooky movies. I, I think you're safe giving people your exact address if you live up in those hills. Yeah, I'll put I, it I've this seen way: the movies, what you guys do. Yeah, you understand the movie Deliverance was filmed not far from where. I <laughs> That, that's that's why Zach is safe from Jay stalking him. Yeah, yeah, nobody's yeah. gonna bother. I put it this yeah. way: I went to my neighbor's house the other day, and he had a gun with a scope on it, and I was like, "Oh, I feel very well protected." So yeah, just, <laughs> I'm, I'm not wor- I'm not worried about people with guns. I'm worried about people yeah. with banjo. Oh, banjos! Well, yeah, we have a <laughs> yeah. lot of that up here too. <laughs> oh, that's what I'm worried about. I- I've seen yeah. enough of them movies. It ain't the gun I'm scared of. Oh, he yeah. worked at Arcada, uh, Arcadia, the Arcado Elementary School. Man, that was a feeder school for my. I went to Camp Creek Elementary School, by the way, Rushmore Show. So I know exactly where Arcado is. Um, that was a lot of kids went to school, middle school, man. That's awesome, man. That's really cool. Yeah, I grew up over it. Go Panthers, man. Yep. Home of Matt Olson, go man. Panthers. Jeff Frank. Go Panthers. Go Panthers, baby. Let's go. Yeah. Hey, we used to, we, our Panthers, though, Will, guess what our Panthers look like? The Clemson that Tigers. Is- we're orange part view pa- we're the part view Panthers, and we're or- we have uniforms just like Clemson, but in, in for paws, we have that you know that Clemson Tiger paw y'all have? Oh I love that's that. our paw for the Part View Panthers. Did you go oh, to Part View? I sure did. I sure did. I went there, my brother, my family, my family still lives there at Part View. I went there class of ninety four. That was <laughs> what thirty years ago this year, man. Let's go. Go Panthers. So I still go back oh, to oh, there this weekend. So, James, uh, looks like Sci Fi Network's doing a marathon of Harry Potter movies. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, they're orange and blue, not like Florida. Yeah. Ew. They're orange and blue, but see, here's the thing, though. Their helmets are just like Clemson's, and they have. They'll have orange and blue uniforms, but they, they look like Clemson for sure. But Clemson wears orange and blue too sometimes. Oh, look there! Is, what's your favorite movie of the series? There's a marathon anytime my wife wants. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I like the last two actually. Did you like four? That was probably my favorite. Goblet, yeah, Goblet was good. Because that's when but it I, started getting darker. I don't even know if I've seen them all or not. I know I watched I've seen the first Harry Potter. I could not. I'm sorry. That's one trilogy I could not get into. I I, I watched the first uh, one and I just was not impressed with it. I, just, honestly, oh, wow. I might be a minority Harry- in that. And I love sci- sci-fi, but I just cannot get into Harry Potter. I love. I'm the biggest Star Wars geek in the world. That's probably my favorite movie of all time. But I I just can't. Just something about Harry Potter. Now I love Batman. That's something ah. I absolutely love. Yeah. <laughs> now, that's a different story right there. Hell yeah! I love that. Mm-hmm. Not, no, I don't. Yeah, I don't yeah. do much for superhero. I don't do much for movies, let alone superhero <laughs> movies. 
I, I, I have the attention span of a fruit fly. Squirrel. I, I, I can't sit squirrel. still that long. <laughs> Jay has the attention of a squirrel. <laughs> yeah, oh, sure. on, on a good day. On a good day. <laughs> That's awesome. Not, yeah. On a good day, yeah. You know, the Rushmore show, show, they are awesome, man. They do this thing where you have the Rushmore of your, like, your favorite movies music uh he's gonna start doing sports uh food all this and uh they had some like really cool stuff that's why y'all gotta go check them out man because they, they've been talking about that if i'm not wrong said he wants to have me on in a few months yeah he was shouting you out tonight will really uh, yeah yeah he was talking about how like he'd come over here and, and saw you he'd probably say here in the chat yeah he was shouting you out tonight man on birth hey rush more hey rush more it's kurt kurt um, by the way his name Kurt, yeah. okay, Kurt, give yeah. us a topic to give our Mount Rushmore up, and we'll go around the horn and do it. Yeah. I think that's going to be a fun one. I want to see what topic he gives us. Yeah. I was about to say, he said Kirk. That's his name. Kurt. <laughs> My yeah, Kurt. All right, Kirk. Kirk. Oh, Kirk. Yeah. You know uh, Kirk Cameron. Uh, you that's right. You know, it's funny. my Southern dialect, Will. No, I know. You know what's funny about the name Kirk? That's my my father's name. Shout out. My dad. That's my dad's okay. name. Well, my Bert's going to be on there Friday. Dad. I'm looking forward to watching it. And man. my YouTube dad is uh, the guy next to me. Jay. <laughs> Jay. Yeah, That's Jay's funny. my YouTube that guy. Dad. Jay's that my guy. YouTube dad. There Jay's you go, YouTube Will. Dad. That guy. Thank yeah, God. Jay's my YouTube dad. There you go. There you go. Oh, I, I hate pointing at you guys when I'm on this damn screen. Oh, man. I was that, doing that That's on my upper left, so I point Is that way and all of a sudden I'm all right. Yeah. Yeah. So, no, I was messing around with James because there's a guy in Harry Potter's a ginger, and I'm like, I don't like Ron. He's like, what's wrong with gingers? Yeah. Because he's a like, way. Love... Yeah. He said, we do movies, TV, music, sports, nostalgic. Of food and video games, yeah, and oh. that's the thing. They're bringing up a lot of stuff like that. I grew up in, you know, I grew up in the eighties. In fact, Kirk, I grew up in in where where you teach it. That's where I grew up in Lilburn, Georgia, in the eighties, and it was a great place, man. We were hanging out at Gwinnett Place Mall. If you know where that is, we were, man. I just had some great memories of my childhood there. And so you're bringing up some of the stuff on your show, man. It's bringing back to those days. Um, we had, it, it, I really, really enjoy y'all's show, man. Especially a person my age and. Uh, Pretty great. He's got a great show, and he's a good, good Christian fella, and a good, good, uh, good, clean show to watch, y'all. I want to say that. It's good, good I had fella. to. Um, so it does anybody have a, a question? Okay, someone give a Rushmore topic, and we'll go and pay, order. Uh, you know what? Because Jay was the first guest. Jay, you choose one. Hmm. Um, I don't know. Um, bears. What? <laughs> Our favorite bears? Our yeah. five favorite bears? But well, grizzlies? First of all, Ru Ru Rushmore's four. So okay, can they be like grizzlies. any kind of bears, also, like Yogi Bear, the Care Bears? What? what okay. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> it's a, if it's a bear, it counts. Man, they can be fiction tough. or non-fiction oh, bears. Okay. Correct. Okay, we'll do okay. we'll do fictional bears. Sure, why not? Uh, I'll do that. I'm going right into that. Let's do. Winnie the okay. Pooh. Let's do okay. three I'll for go. Dale Murphy. Now do it for Dale. You got to do three because there's I mean, no. there's not a lot of bears to choose from. So <laughs> there's I'll a lot of bears. I'll go, I'll go real quick. Uh, Jack Nicholas. He was known as the Golden Bear. William. Oh, that's true. Uh, William the Refrigerator Perry. Was a Chicago. Oh, he played for the Bears. Okay, the Bears. Yeah. Oh no, the Walter Bears. Payton. Sorry, give me Walter the Payton. Bears. Okay. What's up, Ryan? Um, what's up, Ryan? Um, a cup is a type of bear, so give me Ernie Banks. There you go. That's three. And then, and, go then, five. Um, and then I'm gonna do another sports one. Memphis Grizzlies. Um, Grizzlies. Because I got his in-person autograph, and he was a really nice guy, and I met him during All-Star Weekend, I'm going to go with Mike Conley. Okay. He's a grizzly? 
Vancouver Grizzlies. No, so I did a sports bear thing. <laughs> Zach, go that was ahead. that was good. Sports well, bear thing. Yeah. The Rushmore yeah, says ahead. Yogi, Baloo, Smokey, and Pooh. Oh, Winnie the Pooh. Yeah, there's a great. I one. like this. Yeah. Ah oh, man. So Zach, Zach, your turn. Oh man, I gotta think. Okay, well, let me just say this. I'll get really pooted on for this, but shout out to the Care Bears, man. They really they they be my <laughs> number five because one. I went to Gwinnett Place Mall back when I was a kid and saw the Care Bears movie. And them things, they, like, shoot love out of them. Uh, they give me lots of views on my shorts. And they just they just want a hug. So shout out to Care Bears. And then definitely I grew up, you know, Yogi Bear lived in uh, what Jellystone Park. Out, You know, I went out to Yellowstone a few years ago, and I love that place. So shout out to Yogi Bear. And then you don't forget Smokey the Bear. Yeah, Smokey the Bear, man. You don't want to start a forest fire out in the woods because, man, I mean, he's trying to help you keep those fires down. Um, let me think of another bear. Um, oh, oh, I tell you, a bear. Um, what's the name of that bear at Disney World that plays music and looks like the Five Night at Freddy's? Um, Oh, oh, it's all, it's oh the country World. bears. The country, country bears. Country bears. Shout out to those bears. Yeah, country, that's bear, it. country bear jamboree. Cut your bear's jamboree. I you, were gonna, yeah. you know who I thought you were going to say? I thought you were going to say Little John from Robin Hood. Oh, no, no. That would be a no. good one. That would be a good bear. Um, let me think of one more. Um, I guess I'll get. I'll shout out these guys. How about the – Um, no, I don't know. Um, How about the Bernstein Bears? I used to read those in comic books. Yeah, I kid. used to read those as a kid. Okay. Man. I like Man. those bears. James, your turn. <laughs> 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 this is great, y'all. All right. What got so, what got me was the eyes right before that. He's like, yeah. Sick. <laughs> um. All right. Well, one of them. One of them was said by I believe it was Rushmore, right? Uh, hold on, a second. Yeah, I was gonna say Baloo the Bear. So yeah, oh, Baloo yeah. the Bear. Uh, well, who, who plays on, Baloo the Bear? What's his name? God, oh, can't remember. Frank, dude. Some famous singer back then. I yes. Know. I mean, uh, hold on. I actually have it up here. Sort of ish. Uh, voiced by it says Phil Harris. Yes, yeah, Phil Harris. I'm so dumb. Yep, Phil Harris. The original one. Um, anyway, yeah, so Blue the Bear. Uh, bear in the Big Blue House? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's good. Okay. Yeah. Good. Two All thumbs right. up. And technically, Kung Fu Panda's a bear. Kung Fu Panda, yeah. that's a bear. <laughs> Definitely. All right. The Coca-Cola Bears. Oh, man. Those are great. Yeah. Number three. Yeah. They always show up at Christmas James time. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out Coca Cola. That's from the ATL, baby. Let's go. And right number here. number number four, number one is going to be Ted. Nice. I uh, love yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> very very good. Oh man. Fozzy Rushmore. Yes. Fuzzy Bear. Now hold on, hold on. Bear, You've yeah. all named them, man. I've already had the Bernstein Bears taken from me. I've had the Gummy Bears taken from me, and now I've had Fozzy taken from me. <laughs> We'll give so you Fozzie we're, Jay. <laughs> we're 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 gonna go with Fred Bear. Shout out Fred. to Ted Nugent, the music, not okay. the, not the not the mouth. Re Doc. Really, Doc? Really? Okay, really? Bear. I forgot about that one. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> My God, no, that's all over. About that y'all, y'all, y'all are y'all are killing me. Hey, yeah. boo boo. Y'all are y'all are taking all of them. Sorry. Oh my god. Well, let me see. Now I've got Red Bear, Bear Grillis. Yeah. I mean, I suppose why not? Why not? And um, oh, now I now I gotta think. Uh, I got one. Bear Bryant, the original Alabama. Bear coach. Bryant, Alabama. Well, Bear you Bear see, one. no, no. No, I, I I can't do that. Briar oh, Bear from Uncle Remus. Remember yeah, that Briar Bear. Briar Bear. Briar Bear. Briar Bear. Yeah. That's, oh, yeah. Briar Bear. I would say Bear Bear. 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 <laughs> mm. 
All right. How, how, how about that? How about that large hairy guy down the street that likes other guys? Does that count as a bear? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes, it does. Okay. I've got three of them. Oh, actually to kind of go in tow with what you just said. How about Petey, the sexual harassment bear for, <laughs> and uh, from South Park? And, and, and I suppose I'm going to have to put a real, a real bear in there. So let's go with polar bear. Shout out to bear. my high school, one yeah. or two in the con or the one Alondra. or two in the United States, yeah. with the polar bear as a mascot. Teddy, anyone say Teddy Bear, Paddington Bear? I bear. didn't think about that one. That was Teddy I, I, I Teddy thought Rupp about King. I thought about Paddington, but he was a bit too British for me. Yeah, Teddy Rupskin. Teddy yeah, Rupskin. I, 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 I thought about him, but but somebody somebody put it up there. I mean, Cocaine uh, Bear was my number one, well, number two after Fozzie. That's funny. <laughs> Jay, you have two uh, more. Two more. Oh, Rupert. How big's no, my mountain? Dead. Yeah. It's five. It's Rushmore. There, there's only four on Rushmore. Okay, and see, yeah, you, he does it like you have to do it by their president. You know, the ones that are up there on the Rushmore. So you have Washington. I don't, look, I might be off of my. I've never been yeah. on Rushmore, but you have to do it by the different ones that are up there on the Rushmore. Like when he does it, he was saying last night he does it by the. There's a Washington Lincoln. He'll probably be able to explain it in the chat, but All and right, then you have well, like honorable mention too. He said, but I've I had, more thought about this. Before. I, I had know. Fred Bear. What was my second one? Y'all had me distracted, so I missed. Um, um. Then I then I, I had the, the 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 heavy set fuzzy guy. Okay. Uh, all right, we'll go with Teddy Grams because those are bears. Yeah, those were good back in the day. Missouri yeah. State. It doesn't even look like a bear. It looks like a duck. And. <laughs> This is boomer. Have, official, how, official how about the bare naked the ladies? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take B A R E. So that's I, I, I didn't say spelling counts. I said yeah. bear. <laughs> okay. Hey, 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 uh, hey. Uh, Mr. Mr. Chicago. What have, what about Clark, the official team mascot? Um, uh... <laughs> <laughs> what about okay, Zach? Your turn yeah. to think about a topic. Um, oh man. <laughs> okay. Um man, I gotta think of bear. Hmm. That's no, tough. I don't did, know. He already I, did the bears. I'd have to I'd have to do a lot of pondering on this. See, like I get ideas when I'm out on a do lawnmower. Do you want me to do it? Do you want me yeah, to do it? Yeah, you do it because I can't think of off. I'm not a quick thinker. Okay, I'd have to ponder. Uh, this is going to be a tough one, but favorite persons named after your name. Okay, I'll go first. Um, I know this guy's controversy, but Will Smith. Nice. Fresh Prince. I love him as an actor. I love him as an actor. Watch me out your name. butt fucking mouth. Yeah. Um, let's see. Uh, Will Smith in Fresh Prince. William Defoe. Love yep. Will and Defoe. He's Definitely. a fun I saw him in some movie the other night. What was I watching? Um, I'm not a huge Will. Will I am. Nice. He was the villain in Spider Man, wasn't he? Green yeah. Goblin, he was yeah. The Green Green Goblin, Goblin. Goblin. yeah. Um, William the Conqueror of France, because I'm a history buff. And oh, I got one. I got one. Hit me. Five superheroes on Mount Rush. Okay, we'll do yours after. Okay, be next. We'll do yours after. I'll okay. remember that. Um, and uh, I'm trying to think. Um, I'm trying to think. Um, I was thinking William Wallace, but no. What? Oh, he is not William. That's right. He's Willem Dafoe, not William. So that doesn't count. So Will, I mean, Will Smith. kind of. Actually, Willem is a part of Will. So Will yeah. Dafoe. Will Smith, um, Will Ferrell. Okay. Who was the other one I said? He's good. What about what about Wilson the volleyball? Because <laughs> <laughs> no, it's uh, William the Conqueror, Will Smith, Willem Dafoe. Because Will, Willem, Willem is the Dutch version of Will, William, yeah. and um, um, 
let's see. I'm trying to think of one more. Um, you don't know Will Ferrell? He's the, yeah, one of the Will greatest Ferrell. of all time. You know yeah, Will Ferrell. Okay. You gotta give him, man. Yeah. I mean, he... James, your mm. turn. Famous. All James. right. Cool. This is gonna be different. Professor Xavier, <laughs> Darth Vader, Uncle Phil. James Bond. Cyclops. Not James Bond. Oh, are we doing superheroes now? No, no. Those no. are people oh. with my name. James McAfee, Professor Xavier, James, James Martin. Earl Jones. I, I named that wrong. James Earl Jones was Darth Vader. Yeah. Um, James very, Cameron very did good. what? Titanic and Avatar. Uncle Phil, good. James yeah. Avery. Yep. <laughs> Zach, your <laughs> turn. I had to think of something different. <laughs> oh, I don't know any Zachs. Famous um, Zachs? There aren't many. Zach Galifianakis. Can, that's the only one I <laughs> can think is, of. Zach Efron. Zach Efron. Um, Zach Brown. He, Zach Brown. Zach Brown band. Yeah. Zach Brown band. They're from Georgia, too. Uh, Yankee. Zach Britton. Grinky. Sure. I, yeah. Zachary Le Levy. There was that. There was that president, Zachary um, Taylor. Taylor. There aren't many oh, yeah. Zachs out there. Taylor. It looks like a couple sports players. Yeah, that's about Zachary it. Not many things Bennett, that. Zach Martin, Zach okay. Berman, Zach Britton. Then we'll 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 skip you, Jay. Go ahead. We'll skip you. We're making me okay. for superheroes. I'll I'll be here for superheroes and bears. <laughs> okay, okay. First, we're gonna go with Jason Thompson, my son. Nice. Second, we're going to go with Jason Thompson, the first baseman for the Pittsburgh Pirates, Detroit Tigers, and California Angels when I was a kid. Third, we're going to go with Jason Thompson, the first baseman who briefly played for the Padres and Dodgers in the late 90s. Number four, we're going to go with Smoke and Jay. Okay, I like it. Who's that? That's me when I'm off camera. I guess so. Okay. What 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 do you say <laughs> about this is like a person a movie person? Okay. What do you say, Smokey J? Yeah, Smoke that... a J. Smoke a J. So we'll do Zach superheroes. Does it have to be DC or Marvel or both Zach? No, it can be any Super, any format. Superhero. Like it can be DC okay. Marvel. I'll go. Um, okay. I'll go. It can be like it can be. Any kind of superhero. It could be Less, like Star Wars universe. Lesser known okay. superhero. <laughs> so I'll go real quick. Batman's my number one. We all know I love yeah. Batman. Too easy. What's up, Casey? What's up, Katie? Deadpool. Um Yeah, that's tough. Um, I've always loved Robert Downey Jr. as Iron Man. He was just so cool, so fun. And then I will go. I guess Spider-Man because I like Tobey Maguire a little bit and I liked Andrew Garfield. Doing too many of the tops. <laughs> too many of the popular ones I know. Go that's ahead, a good James. one. Every one of them, that's a good choice. That was, good. That was good, five good ones. James. So you got to do five, huh? Oh, I'm sorry. Right. I did five. Four. Take away my – take away Spider-Man. I'm going to leave Iron right. Man. Batman, Deadpool, and um, who was the other one? Iron Man. Iron Man, Man Batman, Deadpool, and um, Spider-Man. There you go. Hey, James, go ahead. Spawn, Hellboy, Static Shock, Green Arrow. Oh, I love Green Arrow, Batman's especially when not on, uh, CW. No Batman. I'm not going to say the same as you. You can. No, I'm not going to. That's some good picks, man. That's out of nowhere, too. Uh, that's what the Google. That's what the Google Google copters for. Look at Space Case hey. card set: Hawkeye, Daredevil, Spidey, so cool. Erica, Thanks, uh, Papa. from something nice. that's killing the, the children. Oh wow! Because awesome. Zach, go ahead. Okay, well, I, here's my first one. This is going to be out of nowhere. Wait, did the you The greatest see Kevin? American hero. You remember that show? R Ralph Hinkle. Yeah, that's one of my favorite superheroes. The greatest oh, American uh, hero. Correction, Ralph Hinkle from the second 
from the second season on. Ralph Hinckley yeah. for the first season, and then someone tried to impress Jody Foster. Yeah, so that was he a had great, to great show. Then definitely Superman. Superman has always been one of my favorites. Going back to Christopher Reed's Superman, um, yeah. I love Smallville was one of my favorite shows on CW. Uh, nice. I love the new Henry Cavill Superman. I'm a big Superman fan. Like I'm nice, nice. That that's definitely part of my history. Um, I guess there definitely be Batman. I mean, there's not a Batman I don't like. Even the cheesy Batmans I liked. Um, I love the 1960s Batman with Burt Ward and um. Oh, um yeah. Oh, what's his name? The original, the 1960 Batman, and they got in trouble. Adam West. Him. Adam West. Adam West. Yes, I don't not know him. He's the icon. And then definitely Michael Keaton was one of the the Batman I grew up with too. Yeah. I mean, that this was an iconic movie. Um, and then the modern day Batmans I like too. I like the new ones uh, of today. Um, so Batman definitely be number three. Um, so I'm going to go a little bit, I guess you could say this guy's a superhero, but to me, he's a superhero, but he's not really a superhero. And that'd be Luke Skywalker. Um, is Luke Skywalker a superhero to me? Yes. He has the force. Uh, He's a Jedi. Uh, He destroyed the Death Star. So he's a superhero to me. Nice. Um, so that would be definitely number four. Um, number five, man, there's only four. There's only four there's right now. Oh, there's only four. Okay. Well, there's my four right there. Yeah. Did you see uh, uh, Joe Manson? Man, Mansman? Gee, sorry. <laughs> Cable, Luke Skywalker, Skywalker, Spider-Man, and Wolverine. Yeah, those are all good. Dean right. Kane. Zach, yeah. go Dean ahead. Dean Kane from Christina, yeah. Zach just did. No. Just did. They want to name superheroes. Yeah. We got Captain Caveman. <laughs> yeah, oh, nice. We, 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 got, we got the Blue Falcon. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> we got the Tick. Oh yeah, <laughs> nice. And, and and we got all them first responders out there. Tell me, yeah. them ain't superheroes. Those are superheroes. I agree with you, Jay. For sure. Guys are bending the rules, and I love it. That's probably the okay. best superhero of all. All those out there. Uh, yes. You know, Hong yeah. Kong Fui. I agree with I agree with random rip. Shout out to Hong Kong. Hong, Fu- Hong, Hong Kong Fu. Fu. <laughs> yeah. Yep. James, your <laughs> turn. My turn. Yeah. For We've all done them. Uh, uh, oh, Mighty Mouse. <laughs> Love Mighty Mouse. Mouse. Nice. Yes. Yeah. <sighs> all right. Top four cartoons growing up. Okay. Or um, your your cartoons so, growing up. Your four cartoons growing up. So okay, this is gonna sound cheesy because I'm the nineties. This is so easy for me. This is um, not like a debate. I can tell you. Oh, only kid, four. I'll say. Yeah. Rushmore. I'll say. I'll say SpongeBob because I was a kid. Um, I'm old. I thought I was a kid. Through that might prove a man. A thing called uh, Drake and Josh. That's not a cartoon. Um, <laughs> oh no, I'm that? sorry. That's not a cartoon. Uh, SpongeBob. Let's see cartoons. Um, the original Teen Titans. Yes. Was that on a Cartoon uh, Planet, a Cartoon Network? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Um, the uh, the the Adventures of Billy and Mandy. Oh yeah, Grim Adventures, yeah. Grim Adventures, Billy Mandy, and uh Popeye. Fairy he says parents. nice. Fair fair fairy odd parents. Oh fairly odd parents, yeah. I nice. wish I grew up Looney Tunes. It'd be up there if I did. Yeah, uh, they were good. Zach, go ahead. Okay, this is a no brainer for me. Okay. G.I. <laughs> Joe, a real American hero. <laughs> I, I, every time G.I. Joe came on Channel 46 in Atlanta when I was a kid, I was just glued to every single episode. Transformers, the cartoon. I mean, I'm just a huge Transformers, more than meets the eye. I like, like G.I. Joe and Transformers were my life as a kid. Nice. Okay. And Super Friends. Super Friends. I okay. mean, come on. I, I just love Super Friends cartoon on ABC Channel 2 in Atlanta as a kid growing up. Um, <laughs> number four. <clears throat> He Man, Masters of the Universe, watched every episode of cartoon when I was a kid of that too, as well. So those would be four. Uh, gosh, I could probably name another bunch more, but those are definitely four. If those four shows were on, I'm watching. 
And I can tell you, I can remember when those shows came on, at what time and what channel in Atlanta as a kid um, they came on. 8 a.m. for uh, Super Friends on ABC Channel 2 and 46 at 4 and 4.30 on, um, every day after school for nice. Transformers. And okay. then 36 at yeah. It was great. Zach, your turn. <clears throat> er, sorry, Jim, yeah. your turn. Okay. <laughs> um, Bob's well, sleepy. First, first of all, get some water we, we got are, are we saying cartoon characters or cartoons? Cartoons. Yeah, I mean, technically cartoons. Well, technically, Bugs Bunny was his own cartoon series on his own. That is also true. Bugs Bunny. Nice. Y'all could see him. Man, he's die hard Bugs Bunny right there. Oh, you're damn right. That was that was tattoo number <laughs> number two in my life behind, behind my Marine Corps tattoo. Yeah. Nice. Um. Oh God, Jabberjaw. Oh. Yeah. It was the yeah. shark. It was a shark. Uh, it was part of that whole Cartoon Network, Hong Kong Fu. Yeah, all that. yeah. Oh, Cartoon Network, my ass. These were when I was a little kid. Well, wasn't it Boomerang? Um, Boomerang. No, no. Hold on, hold on. Uh, Hanna yeah, Barbera. My... Hanna Barbera, right? Yes, yes. That's, that's, that's yes. what I that's what had Yogi Berra on it. And um, yeah, no, it is Boomerang, isn't it? Well, yeah. Boomerang was the station that now all these shows are doing reruns on, but it's Did a Hanna see? Barbera creation. Yeah, and, and Grape Ape. Yeah, I remember that. Did you yeah, like Speed Buggy? I I did. That, oh, I was trying to I was trying to come up with that thing. Speed yeah. Buggy. That's the guys yeah. that are running that Doom Buggy thing. The cartoon. Yeah, yeah I love yeah. that show. Yeah, I remember that. Very. Yeah, let me see. Like okay, I've got I've got two. Um, The Simpsons. Because I grew up on oh, them. Oh, that's iconic, man. I mean, yeah, I grew up on yeah, them. Especially in the late '80s, early '90s, Simpsons was the show. Oh, oh and, that was a great. Um, I used to watch those reruns. Did I, you I'm, watch I'm that? I'm going with the cartoon movie. Um, cartoon he movie. Heavy metal. I watched the crap out of that when I was a okay. youngster. Zach, do you remember this? Or anybody? Wacky races, yeah. right here they have them. I remember the wacky races. Yeah, with uh, Snively, right? Yeah, yeah, Snively yeah. whip. Well, oh was, yeah, was, I do remember that. Wa wacky races was also the Laugh Olympics, if I remember right. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Penelope something, right? Was the pink one the the girl? Yeah, yeah, one? you had you had three teams, three or four teams. Yeah, uh, those are the two that I remember. I know there was a few others. Yeah, actually, it could it might have been a couple different of the Hanna Barberas because I'm thinking Jabberjaw was there and Hong Kong Flu were in there too. Yeah, I think uh, I remember. Weren't they Penelope Pit Stop? The go. the the Ant Hill Mob, um, the 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 Caveman yeah. one, Dick Dastardly. Yeah. So, oh, uh, Dick Dastardly. Why did I say Snively? Jesus. Scooby Doo says Collector Hollett. Well, yeah, Scooby was in there too. Okay, James, so, go yeah. ahead, and then I'm gonna throw one out there that I love. Well, hold on, hold on. So, random rip said Scooby Doo, Land of the Lost, mm -hmm. the Bay City Rollers, the Cough Super Show, and the Bugaloos. Space Case, Looney Tunes, GI Joe, Transformers, and Ducktales. Have you ever seen a show uh, on Cartoon Network called The Squid Billies? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It, yeah. That is supposed to take place exactly where I live. Did you know? That? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Uh, there, another to... reason you don't have to worry about Jay stalking you. Exactly. That show, literally. Okay, I watched yeah. that show. My friend, I was in Athens, Georgia, and my friend was like, "You gotta watch the show. It's just like it, there. It's route just like right where you live." And my gosh, it's supposed to be in this town north of Atlanta, right, North Georgia, uh, with like right up five of the highway where I live off of. And it's, I was like, Oh my gosh, whoever wrote this road made it to where I live. I couldn't believe it. That place, that show. Is Dude, it is the dumbest show ever. It is. <laughs> it is. And it really like makes that. fun of the people that live up here. I was like, Oh my gosh. No yeah. wonder. Nobody Papa, was Papa Bear, Papa Bear says so He-Man, Thundercat, Simpsons and Schoolhouse Rock. I know that was okay, a great James, choice by Papa Bear. Yeah. James, give your list real quick. I got a show that was great that I love. Batman the Animated Series I grew up with. The original from the 90s. Oh, I love that. Yeah. Um Dexter's Lab. Oh, I love that show. 
Hey Arnold. Yep. I didn't really watch all of X Men. Oh, I want to say X Men, but no. Um. Oh shit! I remember watching the original Ghostbusters back when they had a monkey on it. You're a monkey. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, and, and, the, and the Smurfs. And Smurfs. The Smurfs. You know, Smurfs don't get the love they deserve, but Smurfs were Rocko's great. Modern Life. Nice. I love, well, I, I was more an Azrael and Gargamel fan at, when the Smurfs yeah. were on. I love I Smurfs, a, man. And I, I, wait, Smurfs were better in the morning on Saturday. They were on NBC. What's up, Dodgers Town 76 Congo? Um, hey, we're going to go for an hour or more. I think. For, if you guys don't have to, but I am. Um, Zach, are your kids okay? I heard one of them say. Yeah, we, the storm just started coming in. We had lightning. <laughs> And the power just flickered, so I had to go check on them real quick. They're fine. They're fine. Are you oh, sure? God, I, I remember yeah. the snorks. Yeah. Snorks. Oh, those were great, too. Have no fear. Underdog, Underdog. is here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know what? It's a great show. I used to watch Boomerang as a kid before school, and I watched Wacky Races and stuff. You know what I loved? Pink Panther. Mm-hmm. Pink Game Panther was awesome. Yeah, Pink Panther. And then, yeah. and then inside Pink Panther, you got Inspector Clouseau. The Anthony Aardvark. And an Aardvark, I was about to say, is one of the funniest things ever. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I love that. That was a good show, too. Man, this has been so much uh, fun, man. I'm bringing back some good memories right here. Dude, this Boomerang. I, dude, I love Boomerang. Like, I used to watch reruns of Scooby-Doo. I watched um, Perils of Penelope Pit Stop, the one season they had. Yeah. Um, said, Do you remember the world of Sid and Marty Croft theme park and the Omni and Atlanta Escalator CNN used was from it? Oh, no, I don't remember that. Oh, God, Magilla Gorilla. Holy crap, I ain't oh, heard yeah. that in a while. Do you guys remember? I didn't grow up with this show, but Top Cat. Yeah. 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 Hell yeah. Top Cat. Yeah. Uh Jetsons, of course. Hey, James, if mm. you're on your computer, look up old boomerang shows and go through them. We've named a bunch of them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think. <laughs> um a fourth all pro. Hell, I don't know. Josie and the Putsy Cat. I remember what? them. <laughs> I remember Josie. Yeah. Oh God, Touche Turtle. Hell yeah. Oh hell yeah. yeah. You know what was funny about Ricochet Rabbit? You know what was funny? You know what was the funny thing about uh Boomerang was they always did the boomerang along and they always did the one banana, two banana. Like okay, maybe, hey. nobody said Tom and Jerry. Tom and Jerry. Tom and Jerry was on the, you know what they played on the Superstation Channel 17 had the Braves? All they played was Tom and Jerry, the Flintstones, and then Braves baseball <laughs> back in the 80s. <laughs> That's all they ever had. And wrestling. They had wrestling. Nice. I, I remember the uh, Chopper WCW. Bunch. Was that Wheelie of the Chopper Gang? That's what I seem to remember it as. Ooh, Wheelie that of the Chopper bad, Gang. We just had a big lightning strike shook the house. Huckleberry Ham. Oh, Zach, you have to go. Oh, we're good. We still got internet and and, power. Da- and daddy doggy. Yes, chili willy. Voltron, man. I love Voltron. That was, that was before Transformers, man. Voltron was was like pre trans It was the well, original those, Transformers. Those were all my little brother's cartoons. Yeah. Like Voltron and Thundercats and uh, uh, Thundercats. Yeah, my yeah. brother liked that. I'm trying oh, to God, think what- Boomer. Boomerang's what was owned by Cartoon. Boomerang owned by Cartoon Network nowadays, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it is. mm-hmm. basically. Yep. All comes out of Atlanta. GoBots, man, I love GoBots. Wait, the bo- really Anna Barbera and um, Willie, they're from Atlanta. The Cartoon Network's out of Atlanta. Cartoon it's Network, all owned yeah. by Turner. <clears throat> right. Yeah. So TNT, um, the Cartoon Network. TBS. Um, Boomerang, all that comes out of Atlanta. Atlanta, yeah. yeah. CNN. Um, it all, wasn't Ted a, Turner used to own all of it. I mean, wasn't a big fan, but Johnny Quest. Johnny Quest, yeah, that was on. I remember Johnny Quest. 
Yeah, I, w- I wasn't too big of a fan of his either. You know what was a funny show that was laid on uh, Adult Swim? Do you guys remember when Adult Swim, it used to be like 9 o'clock where it would be a lifeguard and they'd be like, blow the whistle and be like, kids out of the pool, it's time for Adult Swim. And then they'll show a slide and says, these shows are not made for kids. Mm-hmm. Um, I think it would hit around 9 o'clock. They would stop. They would start Adult Swim. And late at night, I always I watched it every sporadic. I watched um, the Venture Bros. How, how come nobody said Rid and Stimpy? Right. Oh yeah, I, I said oh. Rocco. Close That's to MTV, it. man. You had to be have money to be able to afford a cable. Nickelodeon. <laughs> no, I get that planet in the Planeteers. Dude, you know what, yeah. James? Dude, when I was James, a kid, ca- guys... cable was for the rich people. I know. Very, me too. Very few I, had dude, it. You know I had to go to my great. neighbors to watch cable. You know. You know what was good, James? Angry Beavers. Mm-hmm. Did you hear what Aeon, I said? Aeon flu. Yeah. Flux. Yeah. Uh, I was pronounced a flu. Captain Planet and the Planeteers. James, you probably remember this show. It used to be on the Disney before. It was like, it was like I, I think before Kim Possible. Do you remember the show Recess? Yeah, that was I loved that show. Yes, Liquid Television. Yes, Liquid Television. I mean, th- those are all things that will come out when I was an adult, though. Well, did you ever watch Jay? Uh, you can't do that on television where they had the green slime. I if did. They said the magic word, did. They get slimed all the time. I, I did. Loved watching that as a yep. kid. Yep. I, I remember both magic words. Yes, that was awesome. Uh, You're I'm, just I'm waiting afraid. for him to say that word. I, I'm, 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 a, I'm afraid to say either one of them right now. <laughs> <laughs> I really am. Zach, did you watch Friends? Did I watch what? Friends. Friends? Yeah. Friends, the television show with Courtney Cox and all them? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I saw that when I was... Oh, guys, yeah. really good did. one by Rushmore. Space Ghost Coast to Coast. Space yeah, Ghost, Ghost, yeah. Ghost. Pat Albert oh, from Pop. I was excited. Pat Pat Albert. Hey, 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 show. Pat Albert. I love Pat Albert. You know what was a great show is um, Harvey Birdman? Attorney yeah. at Law? Yeah. <clears throat> You know what? What's you know when we were growing up, ABC, NBC, and CBS every Saturday morning from about eight a.m. to noon had nothing but cartoons, and mm-hmm. it was just a ritual. You were yeah. flipping between those three channels to watch cartoons, yes. every and Saturday. there was kind of like a competition every Saturday morning who could mm-hmm. dominate the cartoon yeah. morning market. You yeah, don't see that today, though. One thing I noticed is nobody said any of the girl cartoons like Rainbow Bright. Rainbow, I was Care Bears. That's close. Well, Care Bears. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sailor Moon. Right. You, you got, you got me. Yeah. yeah Sailor Moon. Yeah. So, I mean, uh, I mean, you did buddy. see Josie in the Jim. Place, yeah? That's the one I was thinking about. Jim. Uh, I remember I used to stay with these girls when I was a kid, and they used to love to watch the gym. Jim. Jim uh, in the Hall of Yeah. Yeah. That that was my sister. Strawberry shortcake. Yep. Oh God! Oh God! That was also that sister at a younger age. Yeah. Did she have the ones that smell good? And and you know you had the strawberry one and the blueberry um, one. I, I suppose they smelled good, but she carried them everywhere. Yeah. Including the sandbox, and uh, mm-hmm. you know, so I'm I'm sure after a while it didn't smell so good. I stayed with a bunch of girls as a kid, and oh, we cannot miss the most legendary one, My Little Pony. Shout out yeah. to all the bronies out oh, yeah. there, man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, no, I hate bronies. <laughs> Flintstone. <laughs> The yeah, I, those, I mean, yeah. hell, Futurama and uh, Family Guy weren't mentioned either for you younger kids. Mm. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. great Jetsons. Oh man, Jetsons. That's another show that was on Channel Seventeen, the Superstation, all the time. The Jetsons. Yeah, the yeah. Jetsons, Flintstones, and um, man, they were all. No one, no one named Snorks. No, they, yeah, were they, named. Named. Yeah, they were they named. They were named. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, they said I hate the adult chat. cartoons. Is the rich person. Yeah. Well, what do you consider adult cartoon? I mean, yeah, I mean, different. There's different levels of an adult cartoon. <laughs> yeah, there there are. Mm-hmm. 
the baseball bunch with Johnny Bench. Oh my god, is that no secret? That was the Kool Aid Man, and the Kool Aid Man would go through the wall, and you had Johnny Bench. I remember that commercial. Uh, well, well, hell, I, technically the Kool Aid Man was a cartoon, so yeah, he was. I suppose he can. Legend, dude. That man could run through a wall. I mean, oh, then the yeah. wall would in separate ways. The bricks. Yeah. <laughs> Space case said secret of Nim. I rem vaguely remember that. Yeah. You know what I remember, uh, James Invader Zim. The Invader Zim, yeah. Fern Gully, the Last Rainforest. One of the Robin you know Williams movies that weird people don't talk show, about. But I loved as a little little kid because I loved animals. Um, what was the Barney? show? Zaboom, Zaboom. Oh God, Zabuma my my boy. Oh my, my boy could not go a day without jumping around like Zabu. I remember that show. Oh my God, Zabumafu, yeah, dude. Yep. No, no, he he would jump around like Zabu, the the lemur. That was the Zabu. His name was Lemur. Uh, lemur's name was Zabu. <laughs> no, his name was Zabu. This has been a great show, y'all. I was about half asleep. Then we start talking about this. This has been awesome, man. Shout out the Rushmore show who got us going on this, man. This has been fun. Okay. So we had a cartoon show, a cartoon movie show, and a cartoon theme song show. Oh yeah, I mean, there's so many good cartoon oh themes. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah. Oh man. Do you know what I did the other day? I, you know, I'm trying to teach my girls to go in the right direction. So you know, back in the '80s, they had GI Joe PSAs where they would be like, "You yeah. know what? Before you cross the street, don't talk to strangers." You know, and knowing is half the battle. Yo, Joe. So yeah. for like the, until every night, I would show my girls one of those PSAs, make sure that they didn't talk to strangers. They didn't. Um, they made sure they turned the lights off in the house. I don't know. There's all kinds of crazy ones. Um, they didn't drown. They. Uh, it was great, man. I watched these. I was like, this is what I used to watch. Kept me out of trouble. This is gonna keep you out of trouble. So we always GI Joe my, PSAs. My other day. Mysteries is hilarious, by the way. Uh. The <laughs> that show is the stupidest, funniest thing ever. Um. By the way, Zach, he, it reminds me of those sports cards. Like, remember the NFL one was like, don't take steroids, don't do drugs. Yeah. The G.I. Joe PSAs were the best, though, because you'd have a different G.I. Joe that would come out and tell you. Like, and it was so cool. Like, I was like, man, those, those are the best, man. I was like, oh. Oh, dude, Rushmore for sure, man. I would love Y'all got to go check them out, man. Friday nights, Thursday nights, and it's. It's great, man. They they were doing some uh, '80s music bands and, um, and like different. They were doing video game themes and songs and stuff like that, and just all kinds of cool stuff. I was like, man, it's such a great, great show. And it comes on usually. They've been doing something on Thursday nights when they they go to different conventions and stuff like that. And then, you know what I was showing my girls this week? <clears throat> so, have you heard of the new thing they have out today with the kids? It's called Fan Off. It's called Five Nights at Freddy's. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this yeah. crazy psycho thing. But where they got it from was from Showbiz Pizza. Mm -hmm. Okay, Jay, do you remember mm -hmm. Showbiz Pizza? Oh God, yeah, yeah. And it was you would go in there. It's what Chuck E. Cheese is today. Yeah. So you yeah, had this like, animated same, same. band playing, yeah. and I was showing them old Showbiz Pizza commercials back in the day. And I said, "This is where Five Nights at Freddy's originated from," because it was like you would have this animated band play with this gorilla and bear and then you they had like this horrible pizza and a ball pit and um they had all these games you could play and you win coins and stuff it's just like just ski, ski, today, ski ball and ski ball else. Yeah. yeah and we had this one in norcross georgia it's now a chuck e cheese but it was my favorite place to go um back when I was a kid and I was driving past the Chuck E. Cheese and I said, this is where my showbiz pizza was when I was a kid. And then I showed him the video. I went and looked up some videos on YouTube and I was like, Oh my gosh, this is, this is my favorite. You know, it was great. Kids should uh, not I, I, be playing games like five nights at Freddy. Yeah. Mm. It came from a Zach, kid shouldn't that, be doing a lot of things. Zach, didn't you? Yeah. That, that Zach, all comes did, down to responsible parenting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Zach, didn't you tell him to stop playing it at one point? I did. I did. Well, yeah. I mean, it all depends but, on how old the kids are and how yeah, well they Yeah, I was watching it. them play it. And what they play is like a, I've never want, I never let them watch the movie, but there is like this game they play and it's just like little dots. It's not, I watched it over and I looked at it. It's nothing that, that bad, but the movie or nothing, they're not watching that. But the, this little game they play is just like little dots and stuff. I don't know. It just didn't seem that bad, but. 
Yeah. No, I heard the movie is weird. Nah, it was decent. I couldn't tell you. Yeah, I know. Rushmore sure says they had those actors on their show. Yeah. Uh, this Friday is 80s hair metal bands. I mean, good grief. That would be a great topic. Think of the crazy hair, you know, back in the 80s mm. bands, man. I mean, some of those crazy air, 80s bands, you know, they were wild. Does anybody want else want to join? This has been fun. I'm trying trying to think of all the 80 hair metal bands because being a product of the 80s and heavy metal, hair metal was the last thing I wanted to be associated with. It it was all about Metallica and, oh my God, suicidal tendencies and crap like that. We didn't want no striper. Warren. My roommate's kid watched Five Nights. Yeah, yeah, I'm just kind of, I'm kind of, I kind of watch my kids. You know, it's up to every parent's judgment, but I just, I I like to go through. I make sure my kids, you know, I don't want to have a nightmare. I remember when I was a kid, man, Mm -hmm. my neighbors, I would go to my neighbor's house. We'd watch Nightmare on Elm Street or stuff like that, and I wouldn't sleep for like five days. And I don't want my kids to have to go through that. I watched some stuff when I was a kid. I should probably shouldn't have watched like that. When I watched Five Night of uh, Nightmare on Elm Street the first time, and that F- Freddy comes out of the body, and then all that the all the gr- stuff, I was like, I should not watch this. So I'm making sure my kids yeah. don't. Yeah, that's stuff. I can't believe my neighbor had me even watching that when I was a kid. Yeah, every, every parent and child is different. You never know how it's going to yeah. react, and if if you want them, not yeah. really do, doing certain things, but uh, I don't call it hair metal. Sorry, I was when I was eleven. Um, when I was 11, I watched Star Wars Episode 3, and when Obi Wan chops up Anakin, that gave me nightmares. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry. It didn't 11. really affect me very much. Watch, watch Nightmare on Elm Street. Oh, the whole the thing, and, it, and when you're like a kid, and it'll you won't sleep for days. It, it totally. I, I, I grew up watching the cheerleader sleepaway camp mass orgy of murder type movies. Oh man, I watch Friday the 13th. Oh, I heard God, that for scary movie. Children of the uh, Corn. I've watched that stuff when I was a kid. Yeah, something like yeah, well, yeah, that. Children of the Corn too didn't make me sleep when I was a kid with. either. Oh my gosh, I watched Children of the Corn. That that movie scared the me for days as well. So see, as I'm not gonna have I, didn't, I didn't watch like The Exorcist and Children of the Corn, but I, I I was a horny little bastard who thought he was being sneaky. So it was always about so Don't laugh for me now, James. But when I was 15, the first Saw movie where the person tried to reach something and then they trapped their wrists and cut slashed their wrists. Dude, Saw scared me as a kid. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, nothing wrong with being see, my, scared. You also got to understand, too, my oldest is autistic. So sure. that, too, and, affects and the kid every, a little bit differently. Different. My kid's yeah. not like the normal kid. Like, I mean, I, she's is, different. Is your, she's only, yeah. is your yeah. oldest one the only one who's autistic? Yeah, yeah. Now my youngest does have a learning disability, but she, uh, but my oldest is autistic. So you kind of get with autistic kids, you got to be a little more careful. Oh, sure. I, I, I bet, I bet you got to be a bit more vigilant. I bet. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, when I yeah, no, I definitely understand because when I was a kid, maybe in the teens, we were invited to our family friend's house, and I didn't know the kid was autistic. So he'd say, "Come watch this movie with me." I'm like, "Okay." Maybe it's like animated. It was. He was like. Nine, I was like 15, 16, maybe. He was like, okay, let's watch a movie. I'm like, okay, okay, whatever. It was Land Before Time. Mm-hmm. Nice. Mm-hmm. And I already saw that as a kid, but well, yeah. Sometimes, hell, I, if, if my son said, let's watch Land Before Time, I'd watch it with them. Yeah, yeah. that was a pretty good movie. Yeah. Nice. So I'd, I'd sit and I'd probably I'd still cry. Was watching. I'd probably still cry. What in no, Land no, Before I've seen, Time? I, yeah. I've seen so many of those Land Before Time movies, but you know, my my kid was at that age when they were coming out. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. The Shining, yes. Shining, yeah. Oof. yeah. It, it, thank you, Rushmore. Yeah. Before time yeah. Comes. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. That's oh, why yeah. I said I'd I'd probably mm-hmm. still cry. I cry at some um, of the adult movies that we watch. Old Yeller, when he had to yeah, shoot him oh, at the end. 
Bambi, man. I mean, man, I was heart. more heard about Old Yeller than Bambi. Oh, no. The guy in the yeah. <laughs> American Tale, yeah. Fifo. Fifo, yeah. Yep. Fifo goes west. Fifo goes west, yep. Yeah. You know, Zach's collection the other night was ripping the movie, the TV show Dinosaurs. Y'all remember that? Oh, uh, yeah. Not, not the, the baby, not the baby. Not, yeah, not, not the, the mom. And mama. he said the season finale of that show that they all died at the end. Yeah, that it was like very dark. Yeah. Like very they did really dark. die? Yeah, yeah. They all died Technically, at the end. they all died from the meteor or meteor whatever Meteor killed off the dinosaurs. You know? Yeah. 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 Um. Uh, what about the never ending story? I've never watched it. Never never watched it. Yeah, I watched that one time. I watch couldn't get into a, it. Watch that thing where he's right on that little white thing. I just could not get into it. And I watched Fraggle Rock. You know? Oh, oh God, time. yes. Oh, God, but yes. But I just could not get into the never ending story. It was kind of like, I don't know if it's easy. You know what the I frag, mean? The Fraggles really... or the Dozers. And... Yeah, they live down you that street movie, thing. You know what movie I never saw was. um. I heard it's really dark. Is um, Falcor? Yeah, Rushmore said the white thing. Falcor. Uh, uh, Watership Down. Never heard of it. It's oh, the, the one, one that's based on a book. Yeah, it's the bunnies, and it's like survival of the fittest. Mm -hmm. The Alf show ends it's on a cliffhanger. I didn't know that. I didn't see the last hour. And then, uh, you know what's I a good movie is um, definitely the Muppets. I'm a huge Muppet fan. I, I like big time. I like. Me too. I, I like the movie, or I like the book more than the movie. But the book, because the movie is part anime, part real, it kind of tears you up. Is um, Animal Farm. Oh yeah, yeah. I remember reading that as a kid. You got um, to go watch uh, Jay. Go on the Disney Channel right now. If you have Disney <laughs> Channel, and they have all the old Muppet shows from the late seventies, early eighties, and they yeah. have like Mark Hamill on there, um, Christopher Reeve who was Superman, mm -hmm. and they were all special guests. You should see the legendary guests they had on. Oh, Muppets. I re I remember watching. Them. It was so, so awesome, man. I never would have heard of Alice Cooper, and I, I wouldn't have heard of Steve Martin at such a young age. Oh yeah, there was a bunch of people on there. Is yeah. it yeah? Just me? Is it just me? Charlotte's Web was a very emotional movie, too. Oh, that was sad for me when I read the book. Mm -hmm. yeah. But the, go back and I watch had, it. On I had to read it at homework. At homework so oh, man. I didn't that, like we it. had to watch the movie, and then we had to read the book in school, and I was just like, oh, this is press. I was so depressed. <laughs> um, I, I was showing my kids the old Muppet shows from the 70s and 80s, and they just loved it because you would have like a – um, a special singer in each episode, and then mm -hmm. you had these special actors, and it was so good because, like, you had a Have lot of the guys, superheroes and Star yeah, Wars you know guys. Is, you know what's the a funny Martin video? Someone showed, the me is, someone showed me um, when uh, the Muppets sing um, Bohemian Rhapsody, Animal oh, yeah. goes, where it goes, Mama. He goes, Mama, 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 <laughs> Mama. Mama, yeah, it's so funny. Uh -huh. Anim Animal was a good one. Animal's good, oh, dude, yeah. Animal's good. No, yeah, no, space case. Swedish Chef. Swedish Chef. Oh, the the Swedish Chef. Swedish Chef. Order, 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 order. And it's Statler and Waldorf. Statler yeah, and Waldorf. I love the Swedish yes, Chef. I love them grumpy old men, and you can't forget the great Gonzo. Oh, yep. definitely, definitely. Gonzo I was got on the other day. Gonzo I, got on my nerves. We watched this for hours, man. I love those. Yes, the... yes. So, Zach, or Jay, e. I was talking to... Jay, I was talking to the others earlier. I watched uh, on Easter weekend some old, old <laughs> movies. Zach, I don't know if you heard them. They're kind of religious. Not super religious, but one's called The Robe, where the guy gets the robe of Jesus after the whole ordeal. Uh, the greatest it. story ever told. Never heard of it. Um, I watched King of Kings. Never heard of that. And then I watched it. Um, it was a whole marathon. This old movie network. It's called Easter Parade. It was Fred Astaire and um, what's her name? Judy Garland. Mm -hmm. He sings a song about Astaire Easter in that, in that show, right? The movie I'm, Easter Parade, uh, yeah. yeah, 
Yeah, I've been using that song in my shorts for Easter. Uh, I've been doing some candy Easster it, shorts, and I've been, been taking yeah, that song to the movie. Is, and using is, it, my shorts. is it Judy Garland and Fred Astaire? If it is, it's yeah. probably from that movie. Yeah, it's a good. It's a good video. It's, it's a good song to use for shorts, and I got some good views on that too. I did. I went to Walmart and just did Easter candy, and then I put that song onto my shorts. Uh, I've seen some of those uh, black and white Henson commercials. I have. Kermit um, looks way different. Who? A Kurt Kermit does? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I hadn't seen that. I need to go back and see that. Um, the Muppets Elton John episode was a good one. Yeah, I need to go see yeah. that one, too. The, the Steve Martin one, they didn't even have the canned laughter. You can hear the laughter's different on the show. You'll, you'll hear oh, six or seven I bet. people laughing during Steve Martin. And I was like, no, that was the crew. My bet. favorite was Mark Hamill when he was on there because just I mean, well, I'm a big Luke Skywalker fan, but when they did Pigs in Space with Mark Hamill, oh god, yeah, that Pigs was my favorite. Yes. Oh god, Pigs yes. in space. Oh, I love that. I I don't know. I I remember when Sammy Eagle had got a crush on that and Margaret. Oh I yeah, was, I thought that what, was great. Was Sam was the... always. Who was the eagle? Sam in. <laughs> This is telling I'm talking about Jimmy. Yeah. Sam, yeah. Yeah. Sam Eagle. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he was always pissed off at something. <laughs> yeah. Except for when he met Aunt Margaret. Yeah. <laughs> it was funny. Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah. I I'm, I'm a huge Muppets fan. I'm i no, I'm a huge Mark for You gotta see the one with Linda that? Carter's there on there. Dodger Town. Yeah. Dodger Town said it. Manamana. Uh, go watch one with Linda Carter and uh, Miss Miss Piggy gets jealous of Kermit. Oh she yeah, oh Kermit yeah, is gonna, hook, is gonna get with Linda Carter and Miss Piggy <laughs> gets all psychotic about it, and it's great. <laughs> yeah, oh Miss Miss Piggy was always jealous. She mm. was. She loved that. You guys Kermit know well. this? Sam, I, I'm not. Baseball. I'm not surprised. I didn't necessarily know him, but I don't oh, think Nixon. I Nixon. At first, I didn't, I, first I didn't know what he meant. I didn't know what he meant at first. Yeah, I was like, who's knock on? <laughs> no, no, Nixon. Okay. Yeah, I on <laughs> hey, no worries, space case. I do that all the time. I, uh, when I'm chatting, I put like a misletter, dude. Spell check yeah. does it. We, we we call them thumb farts. Yeah. Right. My I, my first Muppet thing I think was one of the movies actually though. Then I think I went back and watched some of the episodes. I watched, I watched the original the most, Muppet movie the other night. It was there great. Was a, I, the, the, the most recent one was eh, was um, yeah. They they've not been as good. They even try to do the show again. It's not as good. Nor the movies no. have been that good. But the the eighties movies of Muppet Manhattan. And the original Muppets and then some of the other Muppet movies were great. And then you'd go to McDonald's and McDonald's would have these glass cups of, of oh, yeah. um, Muppets on them. And so when you went in McDonald's for like a buck, you could get a glass M Muppets movie. Uh, I remember that. In the drive through I remember getting like an apple pie at McDonald's and then getting one of those with it. And it was so cool. We brought it home. It was part of our glasses. You know, we drank. We drank it. We, I still have a few of those at my parents' house. I mean, those things are collectibles now, you know. I wish I had some of the Batman ones still. <clears throat> oh, God. I, I remember the McDonald's cups and the McDonald's plates. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It, it, it wasn't awesome. a trip to McDonald's kids if uh, we weren't begging mom for a plate. We must have had a stack of them about that big. Oh, yeah, the plates. Yeah. I remember the plates. plates. Oh, Dude, great. and they would have like the hamburger and Mayor yes. McCheese and yes. Captain Hook. And oh, I love those, man. Those yes. Are the best. yes, I had all of them. And my sister got them all. That oh, wow. Me because that was my goddamn Fry Guy plate. Fry Guys, mine. man. They that would... was mine. Shout out Fry Guys, man. They have lead in them. Don't no, use them. <laughs> well, a we, lot of things back them. then aren't safe. Yeah, we used we used them. We we used. Yeah, them, look at Jay. Me. He's so, fine. Yeah, I ate off of them. There, there probably ain't no lead left in any of them plates. Yeah, yeah. it's it's all been scraped out. <laughs> we used to have the back at my McDonald's. We had the playground. And on the playground, you would have like Mayor McCheese, and you could go inside Mayor McCheese and play and have play in the mm -hmm. hamburger. Then you had the Fry Guys, and you could ride on them like they were like riding things, mm -hmm. bouncy yep. things. And you had like um, the you had the Hamburger or Jail, 
where you could go and and it like bounced and rotated around, you know. That was the best. They got they got rid of that like in the nineties because they got too many lawsuits. Because yeah, like late ninety, early two thousands. Yeah. yeah, I mean you're in the jail, you're you're in a box hook. Of course you're gonna pass. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know? I'm moving locations because I just realized my room backs up to this elderly woman, so. I don't want to complain in the morning, so oh, you yeah. know what? He's gonna be back at the I'm sure you'll still get a complaint. Yeah. Oh no, I bet I won't. I won't. She'll forget. What's up, Henry? I mean, I, I gotta say, I agree with them. Their food is nasty. Mm. Yeah. But yeah, the indeed. boys are the shit. James, when did? How long do you? I, I'm just asking. How much more do you have with me? How much? Uh, I'll probably do like 20, 20 more minutes or so. What about the rest of you guys? I got to go here in a few minutes. I, I, got, through, but... I got no fucking clue what I'm doing 30 seconds <laughs> from now. <laughs> I'm, I'm probably good. I'm probably going to hit up Jay tomorrow anyway to talk to him during the day because I don't have work. So, Jay, answer your phone. Well. Check oh, Henry, the Henry, schedule first. Henry says you're gonna get a dislike uh, on MySpace. <laughs> I don't have a, you can dislike me uh, on MySpace all you want because I don't have a MySpace page. I, I did. I did. I'm Never that did. old. I'm that old. I still got my Blockbuster card. Oh, I, well, I have that, but I'm just saying I never did hey, MySpace. At Blockbuster. At all. It took me a while to get it, to Facebook. Isn't it still one? What is is my space still around? A pen. It is. Oh, dude, that, is that a Batman pen? Yeah, it's a giant pen. That's cool. Oh, that's awesome. cool. That is awesome. My, you, my, you write big own. words with that? No, I don't know how to spell. I was never taught. <laughs> <laughs> Just check why some have of the a chats. Big, why have a big pen if you yeah. can't write big words? I know. <laughs> yeah, she brought me. She brought me this, and she brought me this last year when she came to visit. Hand sanitizer. Oh, there you go. I like cool. that. Uh, but of course, it's Batman. That's awesome. Oh. Um, isn't <laughs> there... <laughs> nice. Isn't there um, a blockbuster sale in uh, Alaska? Yes. Is that the oh last one? Oh my god! One? Are they get Are they gonna come after me for that yeah. video game? Bend Alaska. Yeah. <laughs> It's late, Jay. You gotta get it in tomorrow. <laughs> oh hell no! Uh -uh. I sold that game years ago. <laughs> Is that a comic? Oh, that's cool. No, it's gonna be the topper to my PlayStation. That's cool. I love that. Yeah, Batman one side and Joker. Oh, the okay. So it's the stickers. Yeah, it's a skin. I need it's a PlayStation a badly. Somebody take pity on me and mail me a PlayStation. Hey, James. James, show the Batmobile there. again. I'll mail you this mini. No, no, not good enough. Not good enough. Does that not good enough. It has to be a five. Oh, it has, has to, to be. be. It has to be a five or else I will throw myself on the ground and have a fit. You pay me for it and I'll send it to you. No, 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 no. Here's the payment. I won't throw right. a fit. What, what, do you, what do you want, Bugs? What do you want me to do? Show the Batmobile I'm getting from you. I want which to show one? Oh, I was gonna say which one. <laughs> he he wants he wants you to send me a PlayStation Five. That's Shit. what he no. said. No, he, I yes, lined you up, do. I, I lined up my backdrop yesterday, and I found out that I have a duplicate. So I'm gonna send it to Vogs. Oh, cool. Yeah, I've seen that one. I go on the Hot Wheels hunt. I'm I always what I'm looking movie for is that one from? I love the hunt. This Batman. is no. It's I'm pretty sure it's either the first or second one. So that's what it looks Knight, like. Just... No, the originals. See, I, I've oh. got a couple of the Batmobiles, but I'm really picky about the ones I get. I'm yeah, gonna I mean, open. You know, I'm gonna open it, James, because I only keep the ones I buy sealed for some dumb reason. I'm a weirdo like that. And you can Let me see. Okay, Ooh. I've got. I've got the. Second one is that the original one? Yeah, the original. Not yeah, the, the original Hot original Wheels. The, one the, or, the original one they made for Hot Wheels. Oh, that probably not. 
because they they put one out a couple years yeah, for TV for a series. year, and then a couple years later they put okay, it says TV series. No, yeah, my, my... Justice League Batmobile TV series in two variations: the Batman Batmobile in blue, Batman video game Batmobile. I saw a white one the other day at the store, and I thought Batmobile. that was wrong. And have this one from the movie Armored. Do you have the gold one? There's a gold one, James. I saw. Uh, I've Not seen the gold one of. too. Yeah, the gold one seems wrong. I, well, anything but the original Batmobile seems wrong. To me. I may send James the gold one. Oh, like that one. Nice. Like yeah, that that's one. the old school right there. That's what I grew up watching. Yeah. And then it, it's buried. I don't want to unbury it, but oh my god! I know. Sorry about the motion sickness. There Dude, you go. Batman, and, Batman and Robin. Yank it out fast. Yeah, I was lucky and found not found. Well, this there's one of Batman and Joker on the rooftop. There's one of Batman in front of the Justice Hall. I think it's called or Hall of Justice. Yep. And I found them all for a good deal, so I got the three of them instead of paying higher prices for them. So that was nice. That's cool. And then obviously all the fun cuz over the years. <laughs> What's that shelf next to you with the Batman? Is that magazines or? Oh, that's Dude, cool. That's I love that. <laughs> Joker, Batman. Uh, are you talking about this, Vox? Hello? Yeah. You talking about that? Yeah. That's uh, wall art. So it's one of the first big gifts that my wife had got me. It's basically framed art, and it, each of the panels in it are the different comic books that they had. That's cool. I love the so, colors on those covers. Those are awesome. You know what's funny is the last one, I actually have the comic of. You've seen it. Yeah, I remember you showed me last night. Dude, yeah. dude. You need. You should buy some of the Detective Batman comics. They are amazing. I know. I gotta start. I gotta start. Uh, no, the only one was what? What I just recently finished the Batman Joker Deadly Duo. Oh, this is another thing she got me one year for my birthday. That's cool. <laughs> That's well, that awesome. Cool. Uh. Yeah, I don't think I have. Oh, they're in the closet again. Oh, all I have is the big guy right here. Oh, that's nice. Cool. That's awesome. Yeah. I have all the other ones in the closet. I like, I mean, I don't know if, how much of my stuff you guys have seen, but I started off as just like gifts over the years from family members and friends, of, and it was just Batman. Like, I liked it growing up as a kid, but then I was, like, never really... And then once I got older, I started, you know, getting into it more. But I was never a comic book person up until recently. Um, and then, yeah, the fun goes, obviously, my wife would get me because she knows Batman. And then it just basically, what, steamrolled into a big old massive collection of random crap. I mean, she got me a Build-A-Bear last year. Cool. For our anniversary, oh, cool. <laughs> you know, and I told I told Will he wants me and him to do like a Batman thing one time, but I got like random knick snack like I showed you there. There's I got lunch pails, beach dude, bags, I think toothpaste, should... toothbrush. Dude, I think we know. should though. I didn't even realize I had many Hot Wheel cars. I thought I had a few of them, but I had like tons of them. Oh, here is another panel. Oh shit! Pow! Dude, I love That's that. Awesome. You know, for the Batman's a freaking piggy bank. Oh, that's dope. <laughs> and then, oh, as I don't drop stuff around. Oh, yeah. nice! I love that Joker. That's a Target cool? exclusive you have down there, that Batman. That's cool. That's yeah, that one, she just got me... I forget why she got it for me. Oh, she went and bought books from Target. She's like, but I found you something. 
You know, I see a lot yeah. of those uh, the Target exclusive ones. They had a WrestleMania one with Mr. T and Hulk Hogan. I was close oh to yeah. It. Oh, speaking I... of wrestling, James, you got to show them the Funko. Oh, the two that I have, the couple that I have out. You can see in the backdrop here. Hold on. No, the wrestling one you picked up recently. Oh you yeah. The yeah. oh the one from today, yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Ah. Knowing me, everything's gonna fall over. Uh, Zach, look what Funko you got recently. Oh, no, today, uh, yesterday, I took my wife for the book rush, and I found Roddy Piper. Oh, I love Roddy Piper. That's awesome. Love, loved Roddy, man. That is great. I, I was always a mouthy bad guy fan. Always. Yeah, I know. I love Roddy, Roddy Piper. I saw so. the big boss man the other day at GameStop, and I did a Ooh. short on it. Oh, nice. It. Ooh, love Boss Man, too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Top County, uh, Georgia, Henry baby. Let's go. Just... No, that's, I don't have action figures or statues. I wish I did. Are you? Do you I got to eventually... start. Do you think Ooh, you'll like that? Maybe if I can start getting some not super expensive. You know, GameStop had Funko Pops. Buy one, get one half off. They had a huge sale on them. The other day. Yeah, they do, but I kind of... Um, Put my foot down and stop shopping at GameStop years ago. Yeah, I don't like their employees. We'll see. I do the rewards thing where they give me five bucks a month, and so I go in there and get a free pack yeah, of ball cards. I, or I did that for the longest time. And then, yeah. Undertaker. Oh, I love that. Yeah, glow Take, in the dark. Taker's cool. Taker's cool. Yeah. I don't have them out, but I have, um, what was it? Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels in a big one, like the Mr. T one and Hogan, mm-hmm. and then I have Brock and Cena in a big one. Oh, but I don't have them cool. out right now. Dude, I, I just love that one they had with Mr. I, T and Hulk Hogan because I was like, yeah, I, it looks like really a nice. On it, match. And it was a Target exclusive too. I want that one. Ooh, baby, See, I, I grew, I grew up yeah. in the days of the territories, so so Target exclusive James, there. What do you want for that? Nothing. <laughs> I'm not selling that. Oh, Bubba Fett. The two Target exclusives that I got last year. That is cool. Yeah. So. Ah. Collector Hog says the movie they live with Roddy Piper was a great oh, movie. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That was good. Oh, yeah. That was good. What's that Very iconic movie said? line. Very iconic. What's that? I, What's that I came movie? here to kick right. ass and eat bubble gum, and I'm out I'm of chewing out of, gum. Uh, I'm out of bubble gum. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. Um. What's that movie that just came out about wrestlers? Oh, um, Iron Claw. Iron Claw. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm w- I'm waiting to watch that. Yeah, me is too. It, me too. Yeah, me too. Yeah, yeah, is gonna, it on Redbox yet? Because I might go get it this week. I've seen uh, it going to get think so. It's going to be on one of the streaming sites soon, I think. Yeah, X number two grew up right by where the Von Ericks were from, or the Adkinsons. She grew up right by there. Iron Claw. I mean, apparently you can do it on Amazon and it's YouTube right now. Oh, yeah. uh, do that. I'll be honest with you. I don't even know if I have a DVD player around here. No, I'm That's a cheap good. ass. I'll wait till I can watch it for free. Right? Yeah. Well, I watch on, a lot on Disney Plus and On one of the streams. I, I, am, I am very anti-Disney. They ruined Star Wars. <laughs> I'll tell you right now, I've been in, I've been anti Disney for so so long. I'll, I'll tell you, Quasimodo did not marry what's her name. Oh, yeah. he, Why he, not? Threw him, he threw himself off the bell tower. Write that in Disney. Yeah, the real Quasimodo. You That's think? cool. Like that. yeah. Well, I get the Disney Plus for the Star yeah, Wars and, and uh, Marvel. The real so that's why I watch. No, Who's a real person. No, but the but the Quasimodo. book he, he throws himself uh, out the bell tower. In the movie, he marries he the chick. Yeah, well, yeah. I get it for the Marvel and Star Wars. That's why I like. It. Wait, the bad guy and the Muppets. In Quasimodo. Wait one sec. So the bad guy and Quasimodo both die. <laughs> I I don't remember. I, I don't remember. I know Quasimodo throws himself out the window or out yeah. the hell tower. I remember that. Queen Sorry Mo- to interrupt <laughs> you, Zach. My bad. Oh, you didn't interrupt okay, me. Huh? 
<laughs> yeah, I don't see. I thought they said it was going to be streaming soon, but I don't see anything. I don't know, supposedly on uh, Mac sometime in April or May. My uh, my just, favorite thing right of now. thinking of Disney movies, my favorite Disney movie of all time since I was a kid was uh, Jungle Book. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But, well, hey, guys, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to jump off of here. It's about 1 o'clock. So thank you, guys. I had a good time tonight, Will. I'm glad yes, to stop sir. by. Thank this you. might be the only thank time thank you'll you. ever see me to stay on here this late because I'm on spring break. Have a good night, Zach. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, have a good night, man. Thank you. Have fun, man. Have fun out awesome, there, man. man. I, I had a great time with you guys. It's been so much fun. And yeah, Zach, there back let me, yeah, yeah, Zach, let me know. When you good night, Christina as well. Good night, Christina. Night. You know when you want me on your show next. Give me way in advance notice. Definitely. Well, right now this vertical thing is is blowing up, so I may not have many guests on for a little while. My my but. question is, why will get advance notice? You know how I knew I was coming on this show. Will said Jay's coming. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> in yeah, fact, he uh, he he pulled the Joe Namath. I, I, I'm going to go solo next next week. I am going to go live from my farm uh, for three pack Thursday. So stay tuned to that. I'm going to rip some packs at my farm in the greenhouse. So you guys be safe. You guys be safe. Night, guys. Y'all have a good one. You guys be safe. Yeah, be, safe guys. Be, be safe guys and have a good one. <laughs> so I know he has that storm. Yeah. And it's coming my way. Yeah. Eh. You'll be fine. You're by yourself. You don't have kids. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> no. What? Shit. My kid would never scare the storms. I'd take them outside when it was going to start. I mean, he, he grew up out in it. Well, I didn't want him scared. Or would we go outside and watch the rain for a few minutes and go back inside? Lightning didn't bother him none. Thunder? No. <laughs> Does anybody I want mean, to join before the stream ends in 15 minutes? I will drop the link. Now, because I'm going to bed. <laughs> now? Oh, you can. Uh, <laughs> You're giving me permission? <laughs> no. Yeah, because uh, yeah, yeah, I'm, already, I'm, at, I'm already at under eight hours. Oh, okay. Man, still gonna Thank get up you, early. Okay, no, hey, always. thank you guys. I, I never nice, get eight hours. It was nice to relax. Well, my thing is, I'm, I'm ADHD, so I'm going to toss and turn. The dogs are going to wake me up in the middle of the night, and yeah. No, me leaving. Huh? Okay, good night, James. I'll talk to you soon. You guys have a good night. Night, Jay. Nice talking to you for a bit. Yeah, yeah, night, chat. Good. Night, everybody. Have fun, folks. Talk to you soon. That sucks, Collector Hog. Jay, are you still down to stream more? Are you about to head out too? But joking me. Um, I'm not choking. Whatever. What? Whatever. Um, my parents aren't home either. <laughs> we'll go through. <laughs> go to bed, and then I'll call you tomorrow during the day. Huh? If you call during the Cubs game. What time's the Cubs game? I haven't looked yet. They'll look first thing in the morning. Cool. Wait, wake up and plan my day around the Cubs game. Do you have it on the TV you watch it? Or do you get WGN? No, no. Um, I, I do have that. Oh, okay. Yeah. I don't even have to pay for it. These guys have a, these guys have sort of agreement with the MLB. Streaming network. So when we get to watch the product, 
Agreed. So, boy, Jay, uh, can you can you watch any game? Yeah. Send me the website. All right. Give me just a second. Just Discord oh. it to me. Yeah. Well, I was going to. I'll be right back. Oh, I'm alone. <laughs> Sweet. All right. Now that he's gone, everybody send me your money. Yep. That that that's the task of the day. Yeah, just open up them wallets. Funny little green pieces of paper in an envelope, write my name on it, and the mailman will know where to take it. Right for Jay. They all know me. Am I the only one in here? Ooh, I might be. <laughs> Hey, leave it to me to keep an odd. Oh, I am tired. Going to bed yet? I got a full Pepsi. Oh. I think it's just you and me, kid. Looks like it. I'll just shut down the stream now because I probably should rest up with this eye. Yeah, yeah. I I, I still gotta be up for a little bit more there, or else I'll fall asleep with full Pepsi and that'll piss me off. What'd you say? I said I should. I said I still gotta be up for about another half hour, or else I'll be going to bed with full Pepsi. And that'll piss me off when I wake up and see a waste of money. Do you want me to keep you? Do you want me to keep you? Don't, you, you don't have to. You don't have to. I can. I can pop in some Red Dead or, or whatever. I don't. I don't care. You don't. You don't need to stay up all night. I have nothing I better to do. Oh, jeez! I got gas. Do you think I should go to bed with this eye thing? I feel like I should. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah, when you go to bed, take your eye with you. Don't don't leave it somewhere. Okay. Well, thank you guys all for joining Jay, Paul, uh, James, Zach. Um uh the chat. Everybody. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. Everybody. Yeah. Ev Thank you. Everybody. We we had a and roller coaster in here today. It was a fun roller coaster. Well, guys. Good night. See you on the next stream. Later, y'all. <laughs>